Hello? 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 Uh, uh. Hello? Hello? Nah, nah, nah. Nah, 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 nah. Hello, welcome to my retrograde Tom stream. Hello, welcome to the Retrograde Tom stream. Wobble Penguin, not to mention Aruka and Novice K, and Paranoid Hero. Paranoid Hero? Card Tube, Zack. What's up, Zack, Metal Deer? Chaos J Dub. Chaos, Hamsters Go. Cold Ass, hello? Hello? What did I think of Queen's Quest V? Great question. Thank you for asking. I thought it was fine. I wasn't, it wasn't. It was not as epic as I remember it being, you know. But I was a kid when I played it—a dumb kid with, you know, barely a brain formed. Um, but it was good. It was. It was fine. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be with the dead ending. But I probably subconsciously remembered a lot of it. Now it's six. I don't feel like I remember much of it, so we'll probably something bad will probably happen, but I save a lot, so we'll probably be okay. Alright, we had a question in the chat about what's the gasoline from. I'll show a clip. I'll show a clip. That's from when I was playing Resident Evil, and also it's from, it's a tie callback. Hi, hi Gorliff. A callback to Natural Dave streams and, and uh, Indigo Prophecy. Bed with Gasoline song. Hi, Mr. Lion. Okay, cool. Sounds good. Thanks, Mr. Lion. Hi, Retro Robino. Playing King's Quest VI today. Uh, the, the, the popular vote said we would play King's Quest VI. I did a very bad poll, which was very confusing. But we're playing King's Quest VI, okay? Now, there was a question. What is... What is... The bed with gasoline from well here it go here it is here's one of the things I have a clip here <laughs> zoom in when you play right, this so this is the this is when the you play the music game. box it we, we were playing it pl in Resident okay, Evil plays this, this guys, song remember this and help me listen this is, everybody this shut is up the and song listen. in Resident Evil she fills my bed with gasoline you have to remember that in Resident yeah. Evil so you can. Play so it I was back, supposed to do. and you can open the door. It was, it's a song from Resident Evil, okay? That didn't make sense. That's the first time I've listened to that today. The devs don't remember the logic between the green cheese recharging the wand. Thank you for everything. That was oh. weird. Hey, Delant, thank you for subbing with Twitch Prime. You'll full sub when you're working? Hey, a sub's a sub, Delant. Thank you for subbing with your Twitch Prime. This is never gonna die. This is going to be around forever. Because I'm not sick of it yet. I like it. The only thing is when I upload videos to YouTube, I'm pretty sure that every video that has this in it, thank you for your sub, gets content ID'd. So just another reason to hate YouTube. Macho Man, do you hate YouTube? Oh, oh yeah. yeah, you know I hate YouTube. By the way... I went on a trip recently. Do you want to hear about it? Do you want to hear about my trip? No? Not right now. Maybe later. Thank you for your sub. Are Prime and regular subs the same thing? The, the same thing to me. The, the same thing to me. Thank you for that sub, Delant. Two months. Two months. You guys want to hear Macho Man's story? Oh, oh yeah. yeah! I want to tell you guys a story. I want to tell you a story, oh yeah, I want to tell you a story about Hulk Hogan and how he's a piece of shit! Nope. Don't want to hear that story. I get, I get the idea of that story, Hulk. We don't need to hear that story. Let's play King's Quest. Let's play King's Quest. Let's watch the opening. King's Quest 6. Here we go. Thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you're having a good day. 
King's Quest 6. Awesome. Let's go. I don't remember this game. I played it when I was a young boy. Long ago in the castle of a kingdom called Daventry. Hi, John Freeman. Whoa. Oh yeah, this is where they have like faux 3D as an intro. Whoa. Put the kids to bed. Why is she so wide downstairs? What's happening? What's wrong with Alexander, her? Alexander, here you are. Shit, those oh, are birthing you're hips. You're not thinking about Kasima, are you? Hmm? Huh? I uh, suppose I am. Huh? Son, it's been months. What? You've got to pull yourself together. After all, you only met her that once. Yeah, I know. What's wrong Have with you? Have you discovered anything about the land of the Green Isles? You met her for no. five minutes. No one's even heard of it. Huh? It's like she's just vanished. I wish I could help. Please try to think about something else, dear. He's got to try, mother. He's got to find his. She got that badonka donk. He's just trying to find a girl he met for five minutes in the last game. Despite his family's concern, Alexander remains tormented by thoughts of Kasima or whatever her name is. Mike, this is about a, a, an obsession and like a stalker. This game's about Alexander turning into a stalker. <laughs> <sighs> I did show her hips. That was a weird angle. <laughs> yeah, my childhood was a King's Quest marathon. This is cool graphical style, though. Alright, why are we listening to, like, an alarm from the future? What? Oh, the mirror. Huh? He's always seeing stuff in this mirror. This game requested you call your radio station and request Girl in the Tower? That is ridiculous. <laughs> Yes, those hips could give birth to a to a a, a, a damn elephant. Wobble penguin. Alexander, Hello. I feel so alone. Another lady in a I tower. I don't know what to do. Alexander, you, I wish you were here. Why are you alone? Kasima, uh, wait, uh, mother, uh, uh, mother, come uh, quick. Why don't you give each other each other's phone number or something like? You love each other so Alexander, much. Alexander, what on earth? <gasps> You're right, meeting for ghost. five minutes. Mother, I saw Kasima. She was in the mirror. In the uh, mirror? Uh, the magic mirror? The yes. mirror? And it showed me how to find her. How? No, it didn't. The stars. Oh, the stars? I saw the stars outside her window. What? I can navigate by the stars. Oh, Alexander. <laughs> if you really go. It will be all right, Mother. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird how their mouths are moving. Three long months, Prince Alexander sailed the known seas and beyond. Why is th the writing in King's Quest I'm realizing is not very good? The the like the um the basic storyline of multiple games is a person saw a girl in a tower in a mirror. <laughs> That's like the storyline for multiple games. Hi Praxis, it is kind of like the internet, I guess. Look, I'm looking at a girl in a tower right now. That I went to I went to www.girlinatower.com. Is this cool though? Do you think they did this with pixel art, or this is like a this is like a 3D program they did this in? Hey, Hakiv. I can't stop thinking about this woman I met for five minutes. Do seagull. This is the seagull person of the game. Flying with the birds. Flying with the birds. Flying with the birds. We became a bird. A infinity. You like Girls in Towers, dog? Don't go to girlinatower.com. It isn't safe. Why'd you link it then, Zach? Oh, there's a boat there. You could have just started on the boat. You didn't have to give us like 10 minutes of a bird flying. This is a clip from a, a, a bird documentary. They put a clip of a bird documentary in there. Yeah, Alexander is so thirsty. <laughs> the uh, the Graham family men are, are super stalky, super creepers. Seagull Simulator 95. I'm navigating by the stars, I guess. Some BS. Like, they could have, uh. I don't know, they could have figured out how to get to each other without having to rely on this mirror. The mirror is, uh. You can just spy on anybody. You should, uh, probably put, like, a curtain over that mirror. Is Graham looking in the mirror again? He gets in trouble for looking at the mirror when uh, his wife's not around. <laughs> Mr. Radon, how you doing? I'm navigating by the stars during the day. Yep, during the day. That doesn't Land even ho. make sense. Land ho! Land ho! Land ho! All right, calm down, Alexander. Stop yelling land ho. Everyone sees the land. Hey, Dave Johnson. 
Before I start, I gotta click on my inventory icon. Okay. How hours pass, and Alexander kept saying land ho. And he wouldn't shut up. And there <laughs> okay. We're going. We're going to the land ho. Land ho. Now I guess you could put your boat on a heading in, at night, and then keep it on that heading during the day. That's how that's how sailing works, right? I think that's how sailing works. You just leave it on a heading. Hey, Megan, I'm streaming on Twitch.tv today. How you? How are you, Megan? A brigantic hello. As the ship nears the shore, day turns to night and the sea turns violent. Oh, I thought we were almost on the land. It said hours pass, and then it just showed the boat sailing still. Nothing new happened. <laughs> Uh-oh, rough seas. What, bro? Whoa. Oh, that's the land, ho. They had to create the dialogue? Okay, cool. <laughs> Slut shammy land. Land ho, that land is not a ho. Land can do whatever it wants with its with its personal relationships. Wanko? Oh no, the boat I guess the boat went down. I guess Alexander doesn't really know how to sail. He saw the land, everyone was like, we saw the land, great, and then we just crashed right into the rocks. What a bunch of doofuses. Good job, Alexander. King's Quest. Tower ho! Land ho! The, the, the hose on the land. Hey, the Jakara. Man, Alexander's kind of a... kind of a goober. I don't know. Like, looking back at the, the King's Quest family as an adult, I'm seeing that they're all a bunch of creepy goobers. Thank you for all the auto-hosts, everybody. I don't know how to thank people for auto-hosts, but it seemed like a lot of people auto-hosted me today. So thank you to those who put me on your auto-hosting list. I don't have anybody on my auto-hosting list because I like to host on a, like, I look to like, I'm watching a channel, host. But now I'm at work a lot, so maybe I gotta set up an auto-hosting list. Nothing wrong with being a creepy goober? There kind of is. <laughs> they just sailed their boat right into the Alexander like, awakens What was the reason to find for this? Himself on an unfamiliar beach. Was there a storm? For a moment, he is too dazed to remember how he got here. He just murdered everyone on that boat because he doesn't then actually know how to sail. He does remember the shipwreck. Yeah. The sea. Remember that shipwreck? Just as he had seen his men safely into the lifeboats, a gigantic wave picked him up and tossed him overboard oh, into just, the churning sea. Just waves. That was the last he'd seen of his Mark, crew. Marklar is a grand. Debris from the shipwreck is scattered along the shore, but of the lifeboats and his men, there is thankfully no trace. Oh, he so can they, only they got killed? He pray that the lifeboat survived the currents, and that his men made their way safely back to Devontree. Probably not. <laughs> probably not. All those men are probably dead. Good job, Alexander. So I click on this car. Alexander is carrying nothing. Alexander is carrying nothing. You gotta turn that speed up. Speech, text, speech. I want speech and text! Come on! I guess we'll have to do just speech. Alexander is... Alexander is carrying nothing. Alexander is carrying nothing. It's like when you have to bleep out a curse on the TLC movies or something. Why am I here? Oh, right. I don't actually know how to sail a boat. Neither did all those guys that looked like pirates. I just thought they looked cool. They weren't actually sailors. Alexander oh! pushes the plank to one side. Look at this. A box has been partially buried under sand. No, there's no subtitles. But I'll turn the volume up. I'll turn. I'll make sure the volume is nice and high. The only problem is I always talk over everything. <laughs> it's kind of a big problem. But oh well, you guys are okay with it. Start. <laughs> Start one. Look what I did already. Oh, that's Alexander just... Alexander moves the plank back to its original position. This is kind of cool. Alexander <laughs> pushes the plank to one side. <laughs> a box has been partially buried under sand. <laughs> Let's get that. Alexander is carrying nothing. It's <laughs> weird, car. Good hint, good hint, car. Let's hear it again before we pick up our first item. Alexander is carrying nothing. Muffin. <laughs> Alexander is carrying muffins. Hi, Sakatumi. Alexander's carrying muffins. Alexander is carrying nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Alexander is carrying nothing. Nothing. That's a new that's a new alert. I'm gonna turn that into an alert. No one talk. Alexander is carrying nothing. Everyone sh wait, why did I just say no one talk? I just said that seriously. 
<laughs> I just said that seriously to you guys. No wooden talk. There's That's... nothing of interest in that part of the box. No, the glowy thing. Alexander takes the coin and leaves the ruined box where it is. I don't take the box. We got a coin. Puzzwiz, first, first, first challenge completed. Maybe text means subtitles? I don't think so. Alexander moves the plank back to its original position. I can either read it out or we can do voice. A lot of these games like to do one or the other. They don't give you both because they're stupid idiots. Now, what's detail? What does that even mean, detail? Is anything changing as I'm doing this? I can't tell. There's something else over here. Uh, so I don't, I don't remember. Alexander picks up his royal insignia ring from the beach. Yeah, why can you move the, this back? It's cool, but I don't know. I like it, though. I like it, though. Uh, oh, so it can work out? <laughs> Please, Tom, shut up. I don't remember the dead ends in this game. I don't I don't remember. The what? What was that? When you get in the water, it starts playing this. The ocean is not as calm as it appears. Underwater currents tug at Alexander's legs. Is that too loud or is that a good volume? Whoa, so he, he could die. Let's die. Let's go die. Wait, save it first. Save it first and then let's go die. We got our signet ring. Alexander is carrying nothing. Alexander is carrying a copper coin of Devantry. I was telling Mach, King that's Graham true. King Graham graces the front of the coin. Oh, King's on, King Graham's on the coin? I was, it's right. I was telling Macho Man and Hulk to shut up. Macho Man and Hulk, shut up. Oh yeah, I'm gonna shut up. Definitely gonna shut up. I'm gonna shut up too. And I'm gonna shut up too, brother. Great, thanks guys for being quiet. Alexander's ring is made of the purest gold and has the insignia of the royal family of Daventry on its face. You can feel like this is uh, how this has advanced. Just this one screen. I'm really happy to just walk around on this one screen. And I'm really happy we're playing more King's Quest. This is cool. I played this game. I had this game on floppies and then at some point in my life... Alexander has no taste for salt water. I'm not telling, I'm touching this. At one point my mom Alexander has and dad no use for the ship debris. threw out a lot of my old games. Like we had a lot of games on discs. I think they threw them all out because they hate me. <laughs> Alexander has no use for the ship debris. For the ship debris. The ship is like ruined. I like it has green. nothing further to offer Alexander. Okay, I mean, I'm just looking around here. Alexander has no need to carry around large rocks. What do you think? Yeah, I'm sorry, novice. I know. I like when it can do... I'm sorry that this isn't the perfect stream experience for you guys with only being speech or only having text. I'm sorry about that. There's nothing I can Alexander do. There's Alexander. nothing I can do about it, okay? Is there anything I can do about it? Oh, no! There's nothing I can do about it. Let's go over here. We solved the first puzzle, which is moving that log. Yeah, the, the, the pixel environments are cool. Oh, I, something happens here. See, I like, I like, uh, I like playing this game. I like how weird memories appear. I feel like I can die here. Oh, I wanted to go die in the, um, in the water, right? Hulk's fine, Infinity. Hulk has a great life. He's a creeper. The ocean is not as calm as it appears. He's got plenty of money and he's a creeper. He's The he... underwater toe is amazingly strong You don't have to worry here. about Hulk. It pulls ferociously at Alexander's legs. Your dad sold your GameCube games. That's screwed Before up, Metal Before Alexander Deer. can retreat, the current grabs his legs. Go! The shifting sand vanishes from beneath his feet. Against his best efforts, he is dragged out to sea. Kill him. I want to see the uh, death animations. The currents around the island pull Alexander under. Yeah. Seems like As the... Alexander struggles to the surface for the third and last time, he finds himself wishing he'd paid more attention to the warning signs of an undertow. Yeah. Wow, there was so much narration for that. You got pulled out to see death. Oh, look at this. Tickets up. Next. Nothing like getting swept off your feet. Oh, the underworld. Man, this game is... Now, this game is the epic King's Quest that I remember. This is, seems real epic. You said no, but Macho Man said yeah. Well, even when he says no, he says yeah, Brigantic. Anus tree? Alexander has no need to carry around large rocks. Well, let me decide. I'm the player. Alexander sees nothing to do there. <laughs> what do I do there? Alexander sees nothing to do there. Sorry. Okay, sorry. I was going to say that a lot. The large ferns would be of little use to Alexander. That's how the sea works. Undertow pulls you out if you go a little bit in and then you're dead. I was in the ocean once in Calif in uh, 
California, I think. And uh, I I felt the feeling of an undertow with my one of my my ex girlfriend, my last ex girlfriend, and it was scary actually because I was trying to I think she was having trouble swimming and I was trying to pull her in. And I think as I was trying to frantically swim in, I ended up like kicking her or something really hard. But I felt a little bit of undertow once, and it was horrifying. I can't imagine a real undertow like that. Anyway, Alexander examines the tree's hollow. I almost died once. Nothing of interest. Nothing in the hollow. That's weird. Alexander can see no reason to death clamber received. about on the old tree. I see he would nothing only scar to do its here. Bark. He would only scar its bark. There's got to be. Come on. There's got to be something here. A hollow in the trunk of the old tree. How is there nothing? A perfect nesting place for wildlife. Oh, maybe you have to bring something here later. You have to bring some wildlife here later. Toot, Alexander toot, toot, sees nothing toot, toot. to do there. <sighs> also, Alexander <laughs> sees nothing to do. Yes, there. also my ex-girlfriend died in the on the Alexander ocean. has no need to carry around large rocks. You're supposed to swim sideways. I don't remember what I did. It was too. It was freaking me out too much that I was getting pulled pulled out to sea. But we made it back in. The large ferns would be of little use to Alexander. What do you think, guys? Should we go to the castle or should we go to the town? I'll let you guys decide. One for castle, two for town. Vote now. Let's go. Macho man. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hey. All right. What? <laughs> uh, you want to... Uh, the people are voting. Do you want to tell us your story now? Oh, oh no. Yeah. I don't feel now's the time to tell you the story. Brother. But I will tell you about how Hulk sucks and is a dork. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? One, two, one, one, two, two. Damn it! Why are my votes always tied? Someone else vote, or at least unless I'm the tiebreaker. <coughs> my polls are always tied, even this one. One, 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 two, two, two. This was one. This is two, right? I. The whole point is so I don't have to decide. All right, car voted one. We're going to the town. I think one was the town. I don't remember what I said. Metal Deer said one, two. All right, stop voting now. <laughs> Alright. Alright, this is like Quest for Glory 3. Chest. The battered chest does not interest Alexander. Why? There it's could be probably full of plain earthenware. Could be something cool in there, dog. Could be something great in there. Alexander isn't interested in the gourd-shaped jugs. Uh-huh. Old lamps for new! Old lamps for new! What? Old lamps for new? You're trading old lamps for new? Or you're trading new lamps? I trade an old lamp to you and I get a new lamp. Is that what we're getting here? Stop voting! Town was two. Good day, Pedro. Oh. <laughs> Good day. Sir. It was? If you would like to get one of my fine new lamps, I'll need an old lamp in trade. Oh, he's. Isn't it a rather bad Whoa. business? Whoa. Look at how Taking awesome old lamps this is. Giving new lamps in exchange? This moving portrait. Well, there's always a chance that I'll find a genie. If I had a genie, well, I'd be richer than a king. Besides, there's always a roaring business in antique luminaries. Antique luminaries. Yeah, that's a pretty shitty business, if you ask me. Wait, you're telling me the town was too? Alright, so let's go back to the castle then. Am I playing this on ScumVM? They added dual mode with both text and speech? No, I was playing it through the Steam version. Um, let me add it to ScumVM and see if I can do that. Alright, well, I think you can still- I think I can just quit. Taking off your adventurer's cap so soon? Yes, I've had it. Okay. So let me go into ScumVM. Uh, where's ScumVM? Here it is. Okay, ScumVM is lo now loaded. Okay, now I just gotta add the game from the game folder. Uh, go up. Uh, Steam. Steam. Okay. Uh, here. Okay, happy? Happy now? Here. Okay, um, Steam apps. Common. Okay, uh, King's Quest collection. Okay, here we go. King's Quest 6. Choose. CD Windows English? Which one do I choose? Which one do I choose? Which one do I choose? Do it doesn't matter, right? DOS. Okay, and then I have to go into... 
graphics, audio. Override global audio settings, text, both. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's try this. Good? Good on you. Good on you, um... Whoa! Well, this looks weird. Oh, I didn't see that before. Is this a bad idea? Oh, it's a different, um... Windows size. Should I be playing the Windows version? I was playing the DOS version because that's what had that uh, was, was in my that's what was in my Steam. Hyperduck, Hakiv. Okay, let me so let me quit then. Should I add the other one? Other version. We'll add the other version. King's Quest Six Windows. Okay, and then we go to override global audio. Both graphics need to go to 3x render mode. You know, I'm torn between Hercules green and Hercules amber. Full screen, no. 3x is what I want. Da 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 da. Hopkins FBI. Remember that, guys? Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. You want to hear that song? That's from Hopkins FBI. Oh man, this window is enormous. Whoa, this window is enormous. Too big. Window was too big. Can't handle a window that size. That's what she said, right, guys? <laughs> All right, graphics. Let's go to two X. Three X was in. That's insanity. That's pure insanity. X X X. I can't handle that many X. Rhombus green. Rhombus amber. Okay, this is a little bit. This is still the same size. What the hell? Did I not click apply? Okay, come on. We can we can do this. We can use. No, I did. Two X normal. How about normal? Okay. Am I doing the wrong thing? Oh, now it's really insanely small. I think I'm doing the 3x. This is just for scum VM. What? This. This. Edit game. I got to edit the game. Oh, here we go. 2x. There we go. Okay. Start. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Thanks, Hakeev. And hopefully this will be a better stream experience for you guys on Twitch.tv. I'm just playing it in my house. Now, but you guys are watching it through the internet. And we can even go back to our old game. Or not. Or not. But it's okay. We know what we did. Ooh, look how smooth it is. Ooh, it looks it looks better. It doesn't look smushed, right? Whoa, it looks higher quality. Alexander pushes the plank to one side. There we go. Everyone thank Hakeev for that. Partially buried under sand. Everyone say thanks, Hakeev, if you want to. But if you don't want to, you don't have to. Hey the Grows. Alexander. We're not playing PUBG today. And we gotta go get our other ring. Hakeev! Stream up. MVP of the day. If there was anything I could do for you. I would do it, but I don't know that there's anything I can do for you. I do know about Roland emulation. I've got a thing on my... I do. I've got a thing on my... um. But this is Windows version now, so it won't matter, right? Ella, Mifi. I've got a thing on my computer called Virtual MIDI Synth, and I've got a Roland in there. If I can use that on this, I will, but I don't think I can. There we go. Duel. Duel. Thanks, Akiv. You made the stream experience better for everyone, and you didn't have to, so I appreciate that. You're an honorary sub, or whatever. I don't know. What's something you can do for a viewer? Let me know what I can do for you, Hakeev, and I will do it. All right, let's go to the castle. He wants a shout-out from the Hulk. Hakeev, do you want to hear Macho Man's story? Is that what you want? Macho Man, do you want to tell your story to Hakeev? Oh yeah! yeah. Alright, well, it's a story about a trip I took. Yeah, oh yeah, a trip, a for real fun trip I took. I jumped off the top rope and went across the ocean to a desert. Oh yeah, it was amazing. It was incredible! And I'm gonna tell you about it right now. 
the things that happened there were crazy, oh yeah. And I'm gonna get into it on the first part of the journey, oh yeah. I was looking at all the life, oh yeah. There were plants and birds and rocks and things. There was sand and hills and rings. The first thing I met was a fly with a buzz and the sky with no clouds, oh yeah. The heat was hot and the ground was dry, but the air was full of sound, oh yeah. I've been through the desert on a horse with no name. It felt good to be out of the rain. In the desert, you can't remember your name. Cause there ain't no one more to give you your pain. La 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 you use that story as an excuse to, to sing a song, you liar. He used that as an excuse to sing a song. That wasn't a story, that was a song. Macho Man's a piece of garbage. I hate Macho Man. I'm starting to hate him. Just kidding, I love him. I love you, Macho Man. At least he didn't mustn't murder kids like Hulk. Not hiding anything useful. Besides, they are too prickly to examine closely. Prickly bushes. Prickly bushes. This is the superior, this is the best version of this game. Now what's in here, I wonder? Oh, I can stand in here. Hut is empty. Ah, I could hide in there. Are these dog soldiers? I'm wondering. I'm also wondering that. Are those dog soldiers? Too slow. Let's go uh, up it. Get it? Not all the way. One down. Try it again. That's perfect. You like the song? Hut is empty. Hakiv left. He does not. He Alexander hated that song. Pass through the castle walls. Twenty quick jacks Nor on can camera. Can them with the guards on alert? We can't go on the walls. No, I don't do quick jacks on camera. I do those off camera. Quick jumping jacks. That is. Has the dumbest lyrics. It's. I think that was. I can't. I think that was a song. Maybe Majin Man was just telling us about his trip to the tune of a of a song. It's the weird. bushes are probably not. All right, prickly bushes. bushes. Alexander can't scale the walls. We can talk to these dogs though. Alexander politely Don't addresses the odd-looking guards at the castle doors, hoping to learn more about his predicament. Yep. Good day to you, guards. I was this cast is so upon high this island quality. in a storm, and I'm a little confused about my location. Could you tell me what place this is and who lives in this castle? Hey, what is that you say? A castaway? A likely story. We haven't had any foreigners in this part since Alhazred arrived. Alhazred. That name uh, rings a bell. Don't be so rude, Gruff. He's not asking for any secrets. You're standing on the Isle of the Crown, lad, and this is the Castle of the Crown. All right. The royal family resides here. Uh, rather, what's left of the royal family? This is this the castle we were looking for? The Isle of the Crown. But tell me, am I anywhere near the land of the Green Isles? This is the land of the Green Isles. Yeah, idiot. The Isle of the Crown is the main island, foolish boy. You dumbass. Then Princess Cosima must live in this very castle. Hey. Hi. The princess is indeed our treasure jewel to God, and we consider it an honor. Do you guys like this version better than the DOS version? Because the DOS, they have totally different um talking portraits. What do you guys like better, Windows or DOS? One for DOS, two for Windows. I think I could deal with this, but I, I almost like the, the older style of the other portraits. Let's go talk to the man in the- whoops. Let's go talk to the man in the- oops. Oh, crap. Okay, let's go talk to the man in the town and see how his portrait's different. They never made any of this. Wait, the Grows says the best version is the ASCII version on the Commodore 64. Well, how do I get that, the Grows? Two, two, one, one, two, two, two. Looks like two's pulling out ahead. And three counts as two. <laughs> the lip sync is pretty good. <laughs> a little Bioware hate coming from the Groves over there. All right, look, it's different. Good day, peddler. Good day, sir. All right, I if like this you version would better. Like to get one of my fine new lamps, I like this guy. I need an old lamp in yeah, this trade. is too good. Isn't We're doing it a this. rather bad business. <laughs> we already oh, talked to that guy. Okay, this this is the. All right, I'm really glad that we're playing this Alexander version. Alexander. I didn't do my homework on versions, and I was playing a shitty and crappy version that didn't even have text oh, and text and voice. Alexander. Ooh, 
I like when I find things. Alexander examines the large no! pot. No! It's currently empty, but a few scraps in the bottom indicate that it is used as a dump site on occasion. Ah, a dump site? More like, uh, you mean someone pooped in there? Oh, a dump site. Is that what they meant? Okay. What the hell? Who is this guy? Looks like, uh, okay. Alexander prefers to keep his leather jerkins firmly on the ground. Quick jerkins. Nick, the, his nickname is Quick Jerkins. If Alexander wants anything from the pawn shop, he'll have to first give pawn the pawn shop, shop. something in trade. Is the music better? Is this music good or bad? Gusak. The stuffed bear is there a way I can improve it? Fleas. Alexander decides to keep his distance. What do I actually want? Probably only probably the only stuff I want is this on here, right? Let's talk to this guy. Good this game's game, great. What can you tell me about the land of the Green Isles? I can tell you she he is looks in familiar. dark time. Without the ferry, communication between the islands has ground to a halt, <laughs> and so nearly has my business. Why the long ages of I want to grow a beard ended, like this guy. Why the crown has not done something about it? This beard's amazing. Me. I love this but style. I am a Soul patch not a with pointy beard. And can only hope for better days. That's a that's an incredible beard. So patch horrible, pointy thing horrible. Put them together, it's not horrible. Great. When I hit, when we get, what what's the goal we need to do to grow that beard? I could think I could grow that beard. They might think I'm weird at work, but what do I care? How bide you, good merchant? How Quite bide you? Well, the uh, purchase would not hurt me any. You want me to purchase something, huh? Alexander takes a closer what you got? look at the items on the car. Turn on GS emulation and the audio settings. Oh, he's got a flute, a boid, a paintbrush, and a little ink thing. GS settings. Okay, okay we need... Wait, why is it saved like this and it doesn't... I guess it's better, right? Uh, okay. Pawnee. Shoppy. Pawnee shoppy. One. So I, now I quit again, right? Taking off your... And then I go... Alright, close this. Then we go into scum them. Okay, and then we edit the game and we go into audio. And I turn on GS emulation. Microsoft GS wavetable synth. That? Do I do ad lib or output rate? <laughs> output rate? Alright, I enabled it. I don't think we do ad lib, right? Okay, I did it. Did I do it? Did I save it? Volume MIDI. My GM device is uh I've got a sound font. No, I've got one somewhere. Should I do I need to do this? Or is this enough? I have this. I can start it up right now. Uh it's called Virtual MIDI Synth. Here it is. I'm starting it up. Virtual MIDI Synth MIDI Converter. Virtual MIDI Synth. I'm starting it up. It started up. Okay, audio. GS Wavetable Synth MIDI. GM device. I'm not getting anything. I've got a sound font. I just have no idea where it is. Let's see. Uh, maybe it's in virtual MIDI synth. Virtual MIDI synth. This it? VDM sound? Is that it? I don't know if that's it. Wait, maybe that is it. No. Okay, go up. Alright, let me find the shortcut. And then I'll figure out where it is from there. Virtual MIDI synth properties. It's in program files. Regular program files. Okay. Roland. I've got the Roland thing that grows. Virtual. Whoops. V. Cable. What? I have a folder called VB and inside is a folder called Cable. Hmm. I wonder what the hell that is. I hate how you just get these random folders on your computer. I keep going into it and you have no idea what they are. I can't stop going into it. Here we go. All right, Lang, ah, uh, base, encoders, hmm, I've got it, maybe it's on my desktop, okay, you've got to go into users, RGT, retrograde top, desktop, okay, all right, where would it be, audio, MIDI, 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 no, not Mednafen, why can't you click on the right thing, MIDI, here we go, what do I do, this one, right, choose, Roland SC55, that's the one. Okay, does that count? Okay, all right. 
Is that going to work? Let's see if that works. Sounds different. Sounds exactly the same. Does it sound different? I don't know. I don't think so. Sounds the same. What's a sound font? It, uh, it like emulates, I think, a higher quality sound card, novice. Okay, we'll go to the game. Play. Restore. Pawnee Shoppy. Oh, it sounds different. Okay, but I have to open this because I got it. My virtual MIDI synth isn't going, but I think because it's doing it through. through, uh, Scum, right? I think it sounds different. Hey, Robbie Bobby Baby, thanks, I missed you too. Wavetable had better sound? I don't know, you guys fight it out and let me know what to do. Alexander takes a closer look at the sounds different. Of the counter. Sounds different. Buzzwiz. Aw, oh, yeah. All right. All right. I see you have noticed my mechanical nightingale. Oh, it's a mechanical she is nightingale. Made of plain tin, but she sings the sweetest song you can imagine. Barely distinguishable from the real thing. Nightingale sings a sweet song. The flute is only made of plain wood, but its notes are fine and true. A flute. Ah, yes, the painter's brush. It was well used by one of the island's best painters. There's a lot of creativity in that brush, and its bristles are still in good condition. Are you saying I should go back and take it off the thing, the, the windows thing, car? Do I need to go make a change? Is that what you're saying? Fellaheen, you can talk, yeah. Have you an interest in tinder boxes? This one is only slightly battered. It holds a good supply of flint, a sturdy striking pad, and even a candle in case you find yourself with naught else to hold the flame. Hey! A used, a used paint. A tinder box, a nightingale, a fruit, and a painting brush. FNB. The back wall of the shop holds various bottles. Hey, you guys know how. Owl. Yeah. No, we can, Car. Who cares, dude? <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. We're gonna make it perfect. Watch me. Ooh, watch me. Over. Okay, don't override. Don't override, right? Default. Or do I do the MT32 emulator? Or, uh, Roland. Who cares? Fluid synth. Set the fluid synth. Okay. Who cares what the viewers think, car? We gotta make this perfect, car. You and me. You and me, car. Um. Ready? <laughs> okay, did we do it? Go. <laughs> okay, let's see if anything changed. Okay, I'm not gonna mess with it anymore, though. It's the same. Ooh! It sounds so good now. It sounds different, it's all echoey. That's probably not good. Yeah, it sounds... I think it sounds better, right? You might as well, novice, right? Nerd tube. Death for seeing how you doing today. Now we we'll just look at these real quick. Alexander, I'm... What do you desire to give me in trade? The items on the front counter are all of equally slight value. We're that sounds good. They are handy items, nonetheless. That sounds real good. Is in stereo now, too? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't have anything to trade you, dog, except for these coins and stuff. I could probably trade you these coins for these things, but I don't know what I want. Alexander, I'm in. So I'm gonna wait. Alexander, I'm gonna wait on that, bro. Uh, have you what do you say? It's something you that's the best creative me? paintbrush I on the uh, island. I don't think we can do anything else here. We can look around a little bit. The back wall of the shop holds various odds and ends. For example, the voices are better, Elamith. Hole hole Thanks, Elamith. For finding those hard to spot holes and for inspiring sales. better audio on the stream. And thanks, Car, for helping. Is the fluid synth the only thing that's working, or is it the combination of adding the Roland and also the fluid synth? Just so I can know for the future. It's a it's a little loud. I just gotta adjust the volume. Ring. Wait. 
Is it my MIDI mixer? No. MIDI mixer ain't it. Is this doing anything? That does, that does nothing. It's something else is happening, and I don't know what it is. Alright, I'll just adjust it over here. Okay. That's good, that's good. Alright, play the game, play the game! Oh no, people are leaving, people are leaving, ah! Alexander can enter the building by using the shop's door. Oh, now the music is way too loud. For new. Compared to the... For new. Now the music is way too loud compared to the voice. How do I fix that? Oh no, look at what we did, we got, we went too deep. We might have to go back, it's just... Hold on, hold on, no, we gotta put this all the way up, because that's only the voices. Yeah, 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 yeah. How fair you been? Ah! Lad, have you an old lad? I got just a MIDI volume in the Scum VM settings. Okay, guys, bear with me, okay? Look, here, look at Macho Man while I fix this. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, he's gotta fix it, so I'm gonna tell you guys a story. One time, me and Hulk were sleeping in the same bed, and he had a nightmare, so... He was feeling really low at the time, at the, and he couldn't get back to sleep. And I told him I would hug him until he fell asleep and rock him like a baby in my arms. Oh yeah. And it actually helped him go back to sleep and, and uh, we haven't talked about it since. But uh, I think that's really what cemented our friendship on and off the mat. All right, great. That was great. So where do I adjust the volume? That was a great story. Um, where do I, what do I do? This? Speech up. Music a little down. MIDI. It's only MIDI gain. I could turn the MIDI gain off. I think that should do it. I think that's going to do it. All right, sorry guys. We got into a little too, we got into tinkering. Maybe we got into a bit too much tinkering. And I apologize to you. I apologize to the hardcore King's Quest VI fans that just want to see their favorite game played by one of the most popular streamers around. How fair you, peddler. That's better, right? Lad, have you That's better! <laughs> it's better. Hey, Super Maha. That's perfect now. Let's go in this bookstore. Hello, I will be right up. All right, ooh, who's this evil person in the now, robe? What mm. can I do for you? Oh, Darushin, you're here for Macho Man. He's on the stream every day. It's perfect. Alexander picks up the book from the small table. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, please take that book. You have my most humble thanks for doing so, good uh -oh. sir. Really? Thanks. Wow, a, wow, a book. Wait, why does I why does he have my why do I have his thanks for taking a book? Alexander is carrying a book from the bargain table in the bookshop. From the bargain table. What type of a book is it? This is weird. Alexander opens the bargain book and reads a paragraph at random. Two dulcimers raised to the degree of forty half dulcimers, divided into equal parts. By the third of a cackle of grouse geese, put over the result of ten fine mackles, albeit small fine mackles, stretched over the total of fifty-three and an eighth bottles of wild beast lard. Mm. Oh. Is it cursed? Phew, what an incredibly boring book. No wonder the bookshop owner wanted to get rid of it so badly. It's a boring, shitty book. He's like, get. why didn't you just throw it in the dumping pot, dog? Books. Does it save me an order, or should I be making an order? Alright, this is great. This is an epic playthrough. What else can we get? Anything else? The table is empty. Fair enough. What about this book? Can the I fireplace have this book? can provide Alexander with nothing but warmth. But there's a book here. Limba? Limba. Alexander rests his feet for a moment. I have a seat. This Alexander is, uh, ancient Barnes and Noble. Idly through a book called "The Changing Role of Court Entertainers Through the Ages." This guy's suspicious. Well, that was refreshing. Very suspicious. There's no back there. How many points do I have right now? Four. Great. We're doing amazing. Whoops. What have I done? 
Let's talk to this robed man, who's obviously the, the big evil Good guy day, in the game. The mysterious old man just ignores Alexander. Who did they say uh, the evil guy was? Uh, like, his name's like Al Hadim or something like that. Good day, sir. Hey, Diva. The mysterious old man just ignores <laughs> Where's Alexander. Where's the Starbucks? Yeah. Where's the Starbucks in here? Where's the potion Alexander bucks? is a little old for those children's books. The alchemy bucks. Star alchemy, right? But that's, I don't think that's Banana Diva. It could be Banana. I don't know if this game has like a connection to five. Alexander Probably is not does. interested in those Five or four books. or three. Okay, this is a pretty shitty place. Good day, sir. I'm a stranger in this Got a point land. just for talking to this what guy. What can you tell me about the land of the Green Isles? Is that less. is quite a question, young man. Who are you? And what would you have me tell you? My name is Alexander. This guy's got a fez on. I know I'm on the Isle of the Crown, but I'd like to know whatever you can tell me about this island, and if there are other islands nearby. You are indeed a stranger. Anxious is the man who knows not the customs of the land beneath his feet. This island is called the Isle of the Crown, because the royal family's castle is here. Besides the castle, we also have this village and the docks over to the west. There are at least three other islands. The Isle of the Sacred Mountain, the Isle of the Beast, and fez. the Isle of Wonder. Why would you wear a fez? At least three? Does no one know for certain? <laughs> this is no ordinary land, Alexander. The land of the Green Isles has always been a place of vague boundaries, as if islands come and go. Legend speaks of a fourth island, an isle shrouded in mists. I myself have never seen it. Then, too, the land of the Green Isles is said to exist on the boundaries of this world and the next. Even darker places are reputed to be closer here than anywhere else in the world. That's quite a claim. <laughs> claim, yes, but probably just local superstition. We who live here on the Isle of the Crown, at least, sleep well enough at night. Those first three islands you mentioned, how might I learn you more climb about a wall them? in this, Ideally, Diva, right? a young man seeking such knowledge would travel to their shores and learn about them firsthand. Meeting the leaders of each place would be helpful, naturally. Unfortunately, the ferry no longer runs between the islands. There has been much political unrest, and it has been too dangerous to travel for years. Perhaps the ferryman can tell you more. He has little enough to do these days. And if you haven't been there already, you might seek an audience at the castle. Thank you kindly, merchant. For all your good advice. I didn't ah, listen to any of that. Advice is free, Alexander. Making use of it costs much more. One question I have is why is he wearing a fez and why would anyone ever wear a fez other than as a joke? Hi, Pizzicato. Dave, hi. Thanks for the host. Go follow Natural Dave and also follow CarTube. My bot was not working, so I had to shout you guys out. And if anyone else didn't get a shout out, I'm sorry. I'm a piece of shit. What else can I say? But I'm a piece of shit. Toodly tee, 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 toodly, toodly, tee, tee, tee. All right, I don't. That guy, that guy said something about there being a bunch of islands, and then he said like, "Oh yeah, you've got some knowledge, but you've got some knowledge, but you gotta go use it, you dumb dumb." Old lamps for new. Ooh, a lady. A lady is outside the, her house. Shh, they really let, let these vines get out of control, guys. That's... This is not good. You lazy thing! Get back to work and stay away from those roses! That's not I good, guys. you a million times. Those flowers are too sweet for the likes of you. You still got to do the breakfast dishes. Oh, my God. And clean the stables yet this morning. What a horrible biatch. Oh, she's mad hot. The stepmother sucks. 
Pizzicato, it's amazing so far. Is this the best King's Quest? Let's make an... We don't really have to make a new save, I mean... Do we? Let's go to books. Maybe we didn't really... I don't think we get, we're, we're dead-ended yet. Can we climb this? Palm trees are beautiful, but neither climbable nor obtainable. Well, maybe we need to turn the music down a little bit more. It's too loud. It's too loud, guys. We need to turn it down once more. It's only going to take a second to do it. Uh, who's hiding a big... Oh, you wear a fez to hide a big tumor? Yeah, that's... that's. Oh, what happened? This didn't actually change. That's what the problem was. This never changed. Okay. Did it change? That never changed. War. War never changes. That's what was wrong. The music volume never changed. When I changed it. Hi, Chromagus. What a... Reminds you of your boss? That lady was awful. Probably because she's jealous of her hot stepdaughter. I think that's better. Wait, is this what changes the music volume? And so I'm... You can change it in here? No, this just changes the voice volume. Alexander. I don't know how this works. We'll just have to try to deal with it. Let's go and try to save this lady. Oh, I can't go until I've been invited. Anyway, back to what I was saying. You don't want to let this get out of hand like this, because that stuff's going to grow into your wall. And that's really it's really going to take over your wall, your walls, and grow under your structure. That's bad. That's real bad. A pot etched by the natural elements of the island decorates the porch. Goodies. The music can be down, I know, but I can't seem to... ...make it happen. Can't seem to make it happen right. Go. You like this, seven and eight? It's just so loud! What's that, a little boy? Hey, stranger, come join me. The water is wonderful. Taking off your what is the deal with this music volume? We cannot continue until we get this fixed. Okay. Maybe we need to get rid of fluid synth because it's screwing up the volume. This only changes in the game. This doesn't actually change anything. Don't override. Midi gain. Maybe I need to take this midi gain down by half. Maybe that'll work. This does nothing. I'll put it at zero and it does nothing. Put it at half. It does nothing. Maybe the midi gain will help. Yeah, I changed it in game, but the change it in game changes everything. It sounds quieter now. Maybe it was all about the midi gain. And I put it up. Speed up. Load. This doesn't actually change the volume of the music. It only changes the vo volume of the voices. Or is it better now? Damn it! It got set back to 250! How? Takanji, how are you? Hey, stranger! Come join me! The water is wonderful! And I can show you the way to the next island! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's edit it. And then... I think the MIDI game gain helped. How does it get changed back? Go! Oh. I think the MIDI gain is what we need to change. Put it out like that. Okay. How'd it go back? 147 does nothing. Just, just the music. Just the music. Not the speech. Just the music. Nah. What, did I, what do I need to listen to? Hey, Rhombus. Now it's... Look, listen how quiet it is now. It's so quiet now. It was the MIDI slider. Okay, now let's restore. Back to this one. Now it's so quiet I can't hear shit. Now it's too quiet! Okay, go back. George, it's too quiet! Jerry! Kramer! Okay, let's put it at... 40. Let's put it at 40. 40. Let's put it at 0.39. 0.39 is the one. I believe in 0.39. This is it. How you doing, Rhombus? 
Good stream the other day. It's not the game volume! It's not the game volume! This seems the same as before! It's not the game volume! <gasps> Stop changing the slider in the game. It's got nothing to do with the slider in the game! Oh, really? I can't touch the slider in the game? Okay, let's put this here. Really, if I touch the slider in the game, no good? All right, this is the last time. Hi, Hold Your Fire. Hi, Troy. Hi, Depeche Up. Hi, Earth Machine. It's too loud! No, it's better. This is it. Don't change the slider in the game. Don't change the slider in the game. When you change the slider in the game, you reset things, I think. Rhombus, good stream the other day. I really want to touch this. But I'll do it over here instead. Alright, let's this should be Alexander good. Hasn't been perfect! It's perfect! Don't touch it! Don't touch anything! Stop touching things. It's perfect now. I did it. Hey stranger, come join me. The water is wonderful, and I can show you the way to the next island. I'm not swimming with a naked boy. Maybe I will if he's gonna show me to the next island. Should we swim with the naked boy? Press one for yes, two for no. Come on, jump in. A little water won't hurt you. All right, let's do it. Show me to the next island, naked boy. Considering the poor condition of the shore, it looks like the easiest way to get into the water is just to jump Retro off edit here. So it looks like that's how you do it. Let's do it. Let's go. The powerful currents grab oh, Alexander. Oh no, he tricked Struggle me. Struggle as he boy. might, he feels himself being pulled out to sea. It was a tie again. The vote was a tie again, you jerks. <laughs> Not a very good swimmer, are you? <laughs> Help me! <laughs> oh my! Sorry, I think. Not. Oh my God, he's a horrible murderer. There was a news story about teens. As his head submerges for the third time, Alexander finds himself that pondering the wisdom of going out on a limb for a stranger. There was this news story about teens that laughed at someone drowning. That that kid is like those teens. All right, so this guy's a murderous. A murderous young Come lad. On, jump in, a little... I'm not jumping in. Good day. I'm Alexander. Murderer. What are you doing in the sea? What does it it's look a naked like boy. I'm doing? I'm swimming. I mean, come join me. The water's wonderful. I can show you the way to the next island. I think not, sir. I'm gonna check out this boat. What are you waiting for? I said I'd show you how to get to the next island, didn't I? So what does this guy do? He just he he encourages people to jump in the water so he can watch them drown that's what he does for fun that's depraved alexander wouldn't know what to do with the old bag that's of depraved sand. super maho that's strange right super maho the young boy in the water just disappeared oh well perhaps he just dove under the water maybe he's like one of those magical he was taking the form of a young naked boy to in, in, oh maybe it's like to catch a predator king's quest to catch a predator and it's like um, that guy he takes the form of a young boy and gets pedos to jump into the water to go after the young boy and then they drown them it's like old school to catch a predator okay I'm cool with that let's go under the cargo bay is unlikely to hold anything of interest or have a very pleasant smell after months of dry docking he's a sea boy Alexander yeah, decides not to descend into the boy. dark hole he had the glowing eye. Wait, do I? Are you saying I need to talk to him? Are you saying I need to do something with him? That I am I dead ended? Takanjia, are you there? Tell me if I'm dead ended. Yeah, what do you want? This this art looks so good. Alexander promises himself that he will not go home until he has determined what Cassandra's feelings are for him. And if stop she... talking to yourself, I want to talk to this guy. Alexander, talk to this guy. Excuse me. My name is Alexander. The owner of the bookshop in the village told me you might be able to help me. I hear you used to run this ferry for the islands. I'd like to talk to you if you have a moment. You say old Ali sent you? I can't see why. The ferry's not running, you know. This is I the understand. Ferry. I'd just like to not talk to you ended. about the islands if you don't mind. Great. Well, I guess it'd be all right if Ali sent you. Well, don't just stand there. Come on inside. Wait, who's Ali? Who's Ali again? I forget who Ali is. What is it you wanted to talk about, young man? I don't know. What's this? What's what do you have here? There's a rabbit's foot on the table. 
It seems the ferryman is Take note of the boy's the glowing gold eyes. Thanks. You you were in the same boat, Takanji. Hello, I'd like to talk about having your rabbit's foot. There's nothing of interest on the I'd like to talk about taking this. I see you have a rabbit's foot. Has it brought you much luck? As you can see, my luck's been out for some time now, despite that old charm. Why don't you take it with you? Perhaps giving the darn thing away will bring me good fortune at last. Okay. Perhaps it will attack. Sounds good. Thank you. Oh, Allie's the bookstore guy? Oh, I thought Allie was a girl's name. Uh, there's a long ending and a short ending. Should I ask how you get either, or is it easy to get both? I'm a visitor to these islands. I'd like to learn what I can about the area. So you said outside. What is it you want to know? Ali. Well, for one Ali. thing, why has the island's only ferry been dry docked? Huh. It just ain't safe to sail these days. What with the islands feuding and all. Wazir al Hazred ordered the ferry closed till things settled down. This guy's the Me? evil guy. I don't think she'll ever see water again. <sighs> but why are the islands feuding? You got me. Something about stolen property or some such thing. Tis a real shame. Things used to be so friendly. Then this unrest is recent. A few years is all, but it's been long enough. Perhaps if the ferry were repaired. This old thing? This ferry's been out of water so long she's no longer even seaworthy. Her boards have dry rot. She'd fall apart at the first taste of seawater. But there must be some way to get off this island. There's only one other way to travel that I know of. A magic map. The owner of the pawn shop can tell you more about that than I can, Alexander. Sorry, Sakatumi. You okay? Da, 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 da. I've been told not to whistle on now. stream. But I can't help myself. Alexander doesn't Can't work. keep my hands to myself. Bop, bop, bop. What did he say? Shit. Tell me more about the ferry. Yeah, tell us about I the ferry. when I used to ferry Queen Alaria and Princess Cosima themselves. There was no thought of danger back then. They used to go visiting to care for the needy and to keep up the friendly the relations Vizier between is evil. the islands. I remember their last trip. Things had started getting nasty by then, and when they came back aboard, I gathered that the queen and the princess had been received a bit coldly. Princess Cosima was such a pretty thing, and she was terribly He's wearing upset. pants. But who could be spreading these lies, she asked the They're queen. They're skin-tight pants. But the queen had no answer. Skin-tight, skin-colored pants. What do you do now that the ferry no longer operates? Me? I'm out of a job. The job my ancestors have held for generations. I'm the only one trained to avoid the reef and the rocks. But that knowledge does me no good now. Is there no other boat on the island? One that might be more seaworthy? Boats don't last long on these shoals, as you may have found out if you got here by ship. You can be quite sure that this old ferry is, or was, the only craft on the island. I get it. The boat, I need to get the boat going again. Tell me more about Princess Cosima. Ah, such a beautiful child, and so pure of heart. Why a country I lighten up, Sakatumi, I stopped her whistling. Mind. Her mother was the same. Lighten up. The king and Stay queen. and watch the stream. They serve the islands, not the other way around. Always thinking about the people. Ah, <sighs> they are sorely missed. Uh-huh. All right, we got to get you this guy's boat going. He's I guess I can see why he's obsessed with the boat. It is good lip syncing. I guess I can see why he's obsessed with the boat cuz it's I mean it's his life. He lives in the boat. Wait, where did like the passengers go? Up on the top? What else can you tell me about the land? Let's see. The Isle of Wonders a lovely spot. A bit crazy, mind you. Got to have a good sense of humor to enjoy it. Really good lip there. sync. It's insanely good. What else can you tell me about the land? The Isle of the Beast is pretty, but unfortunately, you can't get very far onto the island. We have to talk to this guy because he's got hints about the other islands. What else can you tell me about the land? The inhabitants of the Isle of the Sacred <laughs> Mountain are the most gorgeous creatures Hi, you'll ever see. If you ever get to see them, that is. <laughs> this is a good conversation. This is just Alexander saying, what, what else, else can, can you tell me, tell me about, about the land? land? The Castle of the Crown sure is a beauty. 
She's the finest palace ever built, I warrant. I'm good, Jeremy. How are you? What, what else, else can you tell, tell me about, about the land? land? Some say that the land of the Green Isles is near the edge of the world, and that the deadly currents are a result of a magnetism that sucks life from this world to the next. Of course, that's just silly talk. Edge of the world and magnetism. What, what else, else can, can you, you tell me about, about the, the land? land? Let's see. The Isle of Wonder's a lovely spot. A bit crazy. I'm sorry budget. for whistling. I have a good sense of humor to enjoy a tour there. I didn't think the whistling would hurt anybody's ears that much. I'm sorry. I thought I was just lightly whistling along with the fun tune. I thought I was just having fun whistling along with the tune. I didn't realize I was hurting everybody's ears. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait on, turn this off. I'm sorry about that. I feel bad about it. I feel this bad. I feel so bad I turned into sad Keanu. I don't know why I have the th this is a thank you screen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The only one in the What else? What else can you tell me about the land? The Isle of the Beast is pretty. Okay, I think we're done here. <laughs> Good well, conversation. I what else I'll can you tell me about the land? Thanks for allowing me into your home. Posh, not at all. It breaks the boredom, if you know what I mean. Posh. <sighs> Posh. Ah, by only friend I've ever had. We're that guy's only friend. It was as the birds in the heavens. Thank you, Pelheen. Good. Hmm, we've got to save this lady somehow. Alexander this game is so good so far compared to six and one through five compared to five what did i just say compared to six this is so good compared to six this is so good compared to one through five you can just tell how much more like how much it improved and then this sort of seven gets weird i can't wait to try seven okay so we've got bookshop we've got pawn shoppy i know i can probably get one of those objects with this gold coin i just don't know which one to get the rabbit's foot has long, soft fur. Touch it. The long fur of the rabbit's foot is soft to the touch. I have an idea. Old lamps for new... I get it. I'm the only one here. And we've already talked about your lamps, have we? What else can you tell me about the land? How fair you, Pepsi. What movie is what from? Have you a no... No, I don't have a lamp for you. Uh, it's not from a movie. This is from, um... Whoops. That's from, uh, Keanu... Reeves was eating his lunch on the set of a movie. On the set of a movie. Old lamp. I get it! On the set of a movie once. He was eating lunch and he looked really sad and someone took a picture of him. It's sad, Keanu. Look it up. It's a meme or something. I guess, does that count as a meme? Old lamp. I mean, I can't get off the edge of the screen. You miss Cedric? Oh, I can talk like Cedric if you miss it. Oh, let's go to the castle. Is that better, Twill? Hey, Captain Patty, how are you? Can you spit on the old man? No. And you can't shit on him either. You can't shit on anything in this game. I have an idea. I have an idea. Look at my signet ring. There's no reason to use that there. Oh, come on. This music is better. Excuse me, guardsmen. Uh, uh, Guard dogs. Guard dogs. I've been traveling for months. We already I'm listened sorry, to this. But the prin okay, the princess is not taking visitors. I've got a ring. Alexander decides oh! to show his royal insignia ring castle of the crown guards with all of his papers lost in the shipwreck it is the only possible calling card he can think of it's not gonna work good day i'm prince alexander of daventry i'm an acquaintance of princess Cassima. if you could just inform <laughs> I'm her a stalker. i'm a stalker <laughs> so everyone says i'm doing good Let howdy just captain look at that ring. hello i'm an acquaintance aka say, stalker Ruff? kingdom of daventry Prince Alexander. Ah, wait here while I go see what Captain Saladin thinks of this. Captain Saladin? What is he made of vegetables? <laughs> Doing good, Captain Howdy. Thank you. We spent about an hour today tweaking volumes. Is this a furry game? Look, it's a furry game. Furry friendly. Let's the update the um. Turns a moment later with let's a update the t uh, stream creature. title. Captain Saladin speaks with a voice that is gentle but reflects a will of iron. Prince Alexander of Daventry. Furry's I presume. welcome. I'm afraid I'm unfamiliar with your country. <laughs> it's lassie. I'm sure Wizir Al Hazred will want to meet you. It's impossible to take this guy princess, seriously when he looks like Lassie. Follow me. 
incredibly serious dog man. <laughs> Wait, does that mean the- why is the princess in a castle filled with dog men? We're like 45 minutes- Lord Alhazred, uh -oh. a visitor to see you. Uh-oh. Prince Alexander of Daventry. This guy has glowing eyes. What is it that you seek, Prince Alexander? Pardon the intrusion, my lord, but I came to see Princess Cosima. Some months ago, my father, King Graham, saved my family and I from imprisonment under an evil wizard named Mordak. Yes, I did that, yes. The same wizard that kidnapped the princess? Yes. No. Exactly. Wait, yes. When my father rescued us, yeah, put her shirt he on. also liberated Cosima and sent her home. Then your father has my gratitude, and that of the entire kingdom. But I'm afraid I still fail to see the purpose of your visit. Uh, I want to bone the princess. <laughs> well, I came to make sure that Cosima arrived safely and to pay my respects. It's got him trapped. You're Before trapped. Before we parted, she gave me an invitation to visit. I have no doubt she did exactly that at the time, Prince Alexander. However, things have greatly changed for Cosima since her ordeal in Mordak's castle. <laughs> Just hoping Kasima's to get my parents both wet. became ill and died <laughs> while she was gone. Kasima is sequestered in mourning for them as be <laughs> uh, I've princess. come to pay my respects. She is not receiving visitors of any kind. Yes, I saw her in a mirror, though. Even if she were, I do not think your visit would be appropriate. You see, it is time for Kasima to take her responsibilities <laughs> seriously. With her parents gone, she no longer has the luxury to be a carefree maiden. As was her parents' wish, Kasima and I <sighs> are to be wed. We shall rule the kingdom together. I assure you, our oh. marriage is all Kasima wants now. As a prince and a gentleman, it would be best that you leave before there is any further embarrassment. Uh, they've got her trapped. This creeper's I got see. her trapped. I suppose that I was mistaken. I thought for certain that Cosima... Well, I apologize. A young man I met her for five he minutes. I see. thought for certain that... I'm sorry you've oh, wasted well. your time traveling to the land of the Green Isles. And killing all May those guys on the boat. home be swift. Well, I crashed. Perhaps I will take the opportunity I, um, to look around your fair land while I killed I'm a here. bunch of people on a boat trying to get here. I would advise against that. The kingdom is rather, shall we say, inhospitable these days. But it is your neck. You may risk it if you please. Oh, we just got on this guy's radar. Captain Saladin will escort you from the castle. Good day. Captain Saladin, and he looks like a dog. Oh, he was about to kill me. Captain Saladin's not as fun as he looks. He looks like a fun dog to hang out with, but he's not. I think the graphics are you good to conjure. You have hearing with Wazir al -Hazred. I trust you'll respect his wishes and not return. Wazir just... I have been instructed not to let you into the castle again. Good day, my lord. Yo, whose voice is Captain that? Captain Saladin whispers something is that a voice to the from Lands of Lore? The gate, and they nod with understanding. We're not getting back in. Uh, Rhombus, I have not. What's the girl in the tower song? Get Lassie on my side? We'll try. Alexander has a feeling they won't be letting him into the castle again. <laughs> Main character is Beta. <laughs> Alexander's Beta. Um, I, like, thought I want to, like, pay my respects and stuff to the princess. I, I thought that would be a good idea. Uh, we Beta. <laughs> <laughs> Wizier, wizard, wizard. Oh. All right, go this way. Hi, Heisen Wookie. Oh, I can't control with the um. Damn it! I can't control with the arrow keys. It's hard to get on the edge of the screen. Oh, behind the castle. Hey, maybe we could climb up. The graphics are kind of quest for glorious Heisen Wookie. <laughs> oh yeah, all we need is a bone. That's true. Oh, we climbing? The vines are too flimsy to support Alexander. No, the animations are great. Earth machine. Tony J, that's who it is. Tony J from many things, including the thing that I'm remembering. Legacy of Kane. Legacy of Kane. That's that's uh, the dogs is Tony J. Holy crap. The bushes are probably not hiding anything useful. Besides, they are too prickly to examine closely. This game has a song called Girl in the Tower. Does it play in the game? If it plays in the game, I can wait to hear it. 
If not, I'll play it. The bushes are probably not hiding anything useful. It's the included in the ending. Okay, and they told you to request Girl in Tower. That's just like the game that you played on your Twitch.television, Rhombus. Broken Sword 1 HD edition with, uh, you said you'd call, but you never did. The wall is quite solid. Alexander's hands would give way long before the wall did. Is there anything back here? The wall. Build the wall. Walls work, guys. We need to build the wall. Can't go over here? See, I don't know if I can. I just, I can't get on the edge of the screen. My arrow keeps going outside that of way it. way is blocked by heavy foliage. Okay. The guy from the pollen shop is Dave Fenoy. Oh, yeah? Oh, Vol'jin. And wow. No troll here. Hey, Evelyn, did I skip 4 and 5? Uh, I absolutely did not skip 4 and 5. Guess someone hasn't been watching the stream. The narrow path ends abruptly at a pile of boulders. I played 5 also, hold your fire. Guess someone else hasn't been uh, <clears throat> watching the stream. The narrow path ends abruptly at a pile of boulders. <sighs> you guys, you guys, what are you going to do? How am I going to become the most popular Twitch.television broadcaster if you don't <clears throat> watch uh, the stream? Hmm? Foli he, pr he mispronounced foliage? Let's hear that. You're away from Twitch from the week? That's no excuse! Have I started playing six yet? Bad hombres. I guess someone isn't <clears throat> watching the stream. Hi, Lord Polish. How are you? <laughs> Let's go listen to the foliage thing. Get out right on the edge. That way is blocked by heavy foliage. No, he said it right. Hold your fire. Stop trolling this guy. Why are you trolling him? I bet if we hide, well, there's a reason to hide in here. I don't know what it is. Maybe if we just stand in here for a while. <laughs> Damn, Alexander's so beta. He's just standing in this empty hut, hoping something will happen. Poor Alexander. Well, I've got some ideas of things to do. And waiting here seems to be nothing happening. Uh, I think there were other directions. No, there were no other directions to go. Unless we can figure out a way to swim. Let's see. Let's think. Let's go. Duty Shack? Hey, Strahd. Strahd, hi. How long have you been here? Oh, you've been here for one minute. Okay, hi, Strahd. Sorry I didn't say hi to you as soon as you came to the stream. I'll understand if you never want to watch again. He's having some quick jack. <laughs> quick jacks in the empty hut. I think we need to save this girl. I'm a prince. Alexander does what if you switch... Get... A let Kasima marry the uh, evil guy and with the dog people, and just marry this girl. Let me in. Alexander is greeted with silence. Squeak. This game's really cool though so far. Not watching is yeah. Not watching is like being a traitor, Aruka. It's true. Hey Denzilla, how are you? Go to our thinking chair. I'm in the thinking. I'm in a chair. Little glowing eyed boy. Stranger. Not doing it. Not doing it, little boy. I'll throw a rabbit's foot at your ass. Alexander can't hand anything to the boy from here. Okay, maybe we can trade the rabbit's foot in the pawn shop. He disappeared Strange. in smoke. The young boy in the water just disappeared. No, he didn't dive under the water. He's an evil... That's um Captain Saladin or whatever. Or not Captain Saladin. The we <laughs> that weird kid keeps standing in the empty guard tower. Why? Let's see if anything changed in here. Chip, chap, chip, chap. It Hello. Did I will be right up. There's a new person in here now. Let's save this as we can still save under Wii Beta. Wii Beta. You had to watch Twin Peaks. Now, what can I do for you? Nothing, Fez Head. I want to talk to this guy. Good day, sir. Is there anything you can tell me about the land Nailed of the it. Green Isles? I'm sorry, Whoa. but I have no time for idle conversation. I'm too worried about the princess. This guy's voice is familiar too. Hey, Fulkowski, how you doing? Hey, Mr. Steelrose, how you doing? This voice sounds like... Arr. Excuse me again, sir. Who's this you voice? You mentioned the princess. I told you I'm not interested in talking to strangers. Whose voice is this guy? Excuse me again, sir. Excuse me again. You mentioned the princess. Dumbledore. I told you I'm not interested in talking to strangers. Ugh, who is this guy's voice? It's Edwin. What else does he do? Excuse me. I told you I'm not interested in talking to strangers. Ah, it sounds so familiar. Hey, Thorin. Ah, oh, he was in something. 
Oh, he's in like some Disney cartoon. How fair are you, merchant? Hey, merchant. I know your well, name, but I'm gonna call you, you merchant. My only wish is for more time Nickelodeon is something read. like that, Super Maho. How fair are you, merchant? Business could be better. People don't want to read, he says. People don't want to read, he says. A plaque bearing a merchant crest hangs over the doorway. The bookshop owner must be proud of his credentials. What are his credentials? A plaque that he put up himself? How is that a credential? Okay. 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 We gotta figure out where to go. This is fun. Edwin's not listed. Oh, the guy from Mary Poppins. Hey, everybody. I can't do that voice at all. What if we put the rabbit's foot in here? Alexander doesn't see a reason to put that in the tree's hop. In the tree's hop. Don't put that in the tree's hop. Uh, do I need to... Ch Let's see. Do I need to... Trade something for an object? Oh! Good day. This black robe man's in here now. Good day, sir. The old man just glares at Alexander and does not reply. Hi, Ciron. You're building a retro PC? That's cool, Mr. Steel Rose. I'd like to do that someday. I have my old Alienware PC, but that's Windows XP. I don't know if that's really going to do that well. Also, I'm pretty sure it has a motherboard or a RAM problem. The guy in the store, he did DuckTales? Maybe it's DuckTales. Look, here's my old Alienware PC. I got it from my house. Oh, look at this. Look at how big computers used to be. Maybe you can't get a sense of scale, but look how big this is. It's enormous. Look at this thing. Now, don't worry. I bought this a long time ago. Look. This thing is huge. It's an XP computer. Maybe that's good for a retro PC computer. It was overpriced. I actually don't think it was that overpriced when it first... It was like when Alienware... Early Alienware. I don't, I don't think it was that overpriced. But I'm sure it probably was. Your current PC is bigger? I mean, that's definitely... My current PC is probably like 75% the size of that one. Maybe just the case is big or something. It's heavy as hell, though. Hi, Hate Legend. What's up, Heat Legend? Um... What? Something about the sign? <laughs> I'm really tiny. It's hard, yeah, it's hard to get a sense of scale. I thought it was my luggage. Nope, that was my... It's like a 10 plus year old PC from Windows XP. From Windows XP. Yeah, maybe it was the K. I don't know. It was just freaking huge, man. I don't even know if that has a video card in it. Good day, sir. The old man just glares at Alexander and does not reply. Pretty sure that doesn't even have a video card because the video card forked out. Does OBS run on XP? Well, I would output to my current PC. I would play on that PC, stream on my current PC, I think. I think that's what I would do. Sort of like a console. Hi, Red Hot God. It's not a Fiat. It wasn't a car. What is this guy's deal? A mysterious old man also patronizes Is this guy evil shop. or good? He steals sidelong glances at Alexander. You got new PC parts, Dave? Oh, that's good. That's good. You should have just built a computer in the first place that was going to last. Don't you think? Hey, Jack Kunos. Oh, yeah, the King's Quest guy doesn't have a hat. We can't really wear this hat. Doesn't, I mean, it doesn't really make sense. So we can't wear the hat. Anyway, let's save. We beta. This guy's beta, Dave. Let's give this guy a coin. I have this copper coin. Copper coin! Is it of any value to you I have this all? copper coin! Hmm, most interesting. I have never seen a Daventry coin before, but it is copper genuine Dave, enough. I'm gonna grow this beard. I might even find a buyer who is interested in foreign currency. The items on the front counter are the only things in the store that I can let go for the price of one copper. You may make your choice from there. Alexander looks at the items on the counter to make his selection. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want? That's good, Dave. Wait, this guy... This might be Chuck McCann. DuckTales characters. Maybe that's where I know him from. DuckTales. I was a big DuckTales fan. Crush with the bear statue, just tilt it over. 
That'd be fun. Okay. Uh, flute, bird, bird. That mechanical nightingale looks intriguing. Flute? I believe I'll take it. Very well. Your coin is well spent. Okay. Remember, this is a pawn shop. I am always willing to take back my own goods in trade. I'll remember. Thank you. Oh, really? That's annoying. So I can trade this in for something else if it's not correct? The mechanical nightingale is made of tin painted dreary shades of brown to match the coloring of a real nightingale. Yeah, man. A small key emerges from its back. A small key emerges from its back. The mechanical nightingale's hard tin body doesn't feel anything like a real bird's soft feathers. Ye old trading game. Hey, Skyline. Yes, we're Alexander. He's got the glowing eyes, so he is evil. Well, you want a rabbit's foot too, ya ding dong? Ya, ya ding ding? Would you be interested in making a trade for this merchant? Hmm, a rabbit's foot. I do not believe I could use that. Oh, do we want something else? The punch. Do I need a fire or a flute? The only thing I could think is maybe I need a flute. I'm thinking I put the the, the bird in the, uh, wait. This game has really obscure solutions, doesn't it? Does the lamp count as... I can trade the lamp to that guy? I'm vaguely remembering doing this. Alexander doesn't see a reason to put that in the tree's hop. I guess that was wrong, in the tree's hop. So I'm gonna go get the lamp and maybe go give it to that guy, but... Then I have nothing else to trade back to this guy again. Good yeah, day. he gave me the bird. Have a bird back. Would you mind if I traded this This sucks. In? Certainly not straight. Alex this sucks. I'll take the flute I'll take instead. the flute. Oh, I was Very gonna take the sir. lamp. Thank you. Alright, let's play the flute. Let's play some flutey. Flute time. Alexander plays a lovely little tune on the flute. I have an ASOS computer. I have an ASUS mother computer. I've got an ASUS. Wanna flute? Would you be interested in... No! Leave me alone! Okay. You don't want a flute? You want this ring? You want this book? Would you be interested in trading for this book? I am afraid not. Books are more my neighbor's line of work. After all, I would not want him selling curiosities. A 980 GTX is good? I thought only 1080s were good, and 1070. I'm eating a soft pretzel, one of my guilty pleasures. Because I'm hungry. Would you mind if I traded this in? Certainly not. I believe... Very good, sir. Does Tinderbox Enjoy count as a, a lamp? So see if it counts as a lamp. This is a really good pretzel. Soft pretzel. Mm-hmm. Let's see if this counts. Save it. Save it for... Would you accept this in exchange for one of your lamps, peddler? I am only interested in old lamps, son. Sorry. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Uh... Okay. I don't know, really know what to do. Could be something with this house. The man's eyes are glowing because it's the evil guy from in the castle. Mm -mm. I have an idea. I have an idea. Uh... I think we gotta go get the nightingale. And then, like, make it sing behind the castle. Then the girl will look out at us, and then we'll talk to her. I don't know why, but I feel like that's what we're supposed to Good do. Good day! Good day, Effendi. Good day, Effendi. Would you mind if I traded this in? These pretzels are delicious, so Takanjia. They're that not making me thirsty. Nightingale looks we're making me less hungry. Thank you. Unless we're supposed to play the flute at back. The duck flutey. I got a lamp fetish. Hey, Love Lust, how are you? I'm eating a pretzel right now. You guys are watching. This is a real life wa watching a human eat. Enjoy. You don't get to see this every day. Unless you eat in a mirror. Going the wrong way. 
But really, who eats in a mirror? If you eat if you eat in front of a mirror, you might be a little weird. Old lamps for new No, I'm trying to leave. I mean, this is kind of like oh, I just okay, that now it's getting gross cuz I'm spitting food. Don't worry, I'm cleaning it up. Or even napkin. That was that was a little gross. That might have been a little gross. I think we just lost a viewer. Hello, thy art metal. Alexander has no It's King's Quest while eating a pretzel. Um, what we're we talking about? This is kind of like eating in front of a mirror because I can see my stream over here because you got to keep an eye on it if you're a professional. Lord Polish says, I hope your wife doesn't see you eating that. Pudgy. You mean she's going to she's gonna say that? The door's closed. She can't see Lord Polish. That's right. I'm talking with a mouthful of spitting food all over the cat, all over the desk. And it's delicious. It's worth it. It's worth every second. Here we go. The mechanical nightingale. Go. Go. Why would El go? Why? There's go. no reason. Go. No go. Oh no! Can we climb? The wall is climb this. The vines are too. The vines are too flimsy. Hmm. What gets us up that wall? Do we? Maybe we gotta go. Maybe we gotta go get the flute. Or. Hide in here. We could just hide in here for a while. Raise your climbing stat. Yeah, might need to raise our climbing stat. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. There's something in that hole. Get over here. Get your ass in the tree. Alexander. Alex. Alexander. Alex. 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 No. Why do keyboard vax exist? Exactly. Fell right in between the keys. Got some chewed food in the keys. How you guys enjoying watching me Good chew day. my food with my mouth open and talk? Hope you're enjoying it a lot. This is the would you? This is the core retro Tom grade experience. Paintbrush. Hold on. I remember what you used the paintbrush for. You paint a door on something. That's it. And that's it. That's it. Pretzel gone. Dinner. Dinner gone. I'll take the... Hold on. Do I paint it on the Very wall? Good, sir. Thank you. Save here. We'll go try playing the flute somewhere. What if I play the flute? The no, I already played the flute in front of this guy. Heat Legend, thank you for that sub! Heat Legend, thank you for subbing for four months. Salt pretzel for dinner, hell yeah. Maybe we paint a door on the wall, but we need the right paint. Throw in some nom noms? Aw, oh, I should have. It's too late. I'm already done eating it. New season of People of Earth? I don't know what that is, Siron. Save state, save time, hell yeah. Paint the door on the flute, that's, an, that's another idea. All right, sorry, we're done the pretzel. I'm sorry, those are, that's what you that came here just to watch eat the pretzel being eaten, it's done. It's done, get over it, get used to it. Virtualgridtom.com. Uh, maybe we play the flute out back? Maybe this is it? That would serve no- Play! Why would Ellie- Yeah? Alexander plays a love- it didn't do anything. The wall is... The wall. The wall. The vine. I kind of think I need to paint a door in this wall. I'm going to load. I feel like I need to paint a door in this wall. Don't know why. Would you... But I just feel like that's what I need to do. Certainly not. Ale Let's give that a shot. I think I... I think I'd like the painter's brush. Thank you. This guy's... This guy's really good at... T with his returns policy. Is really great. What if I traded you for that copper coin again? People of Earth? This is a good show. Megan, wrong channel. Heat Legend, thank you for that four months of subbers. <laughs> He's a wannabe Link. He's got tight pants. He's got tight black pants on, by the way. He's, he's got his pants tucked into his boots. 
He's got a black, tight black leotard tucked into his boots. Am I supposed to paint a door on this wall? No, don't leave. Damn it, dude. Damn it, bro. No, I think you do that. I don't know if you do that right now, but I think you do that at some point, Diva. You're welcome, Strahd. Whatever I did, you're welcome. Alexander might have a paintbrush, but he does not have any paint. Okay. I'm, uh, I'm actually stuck already. I am actually stuck already. Wow. Would you Because there's nowhere else I can go. Sit. Ale Take the bird. That mechanic. Let's take the bird and then maybe go to the fairy guy, see if the fairy guy has anything else to say. What domain? Very good return policy. He just will take exchanges for anything over and over again that he gave to us. No, we have no paint. Get, get, get. Alright, that little boy's gone. Maybe we can jump in the water now that the boy's gone. Maybe there's something else I can get somewhere. What would Alexander do with that huge sheet of canvas? Paint on it. The cargo bay is unlikely to... It's not going to go into the hole? Paint with the colors of the wind? I don't think so. Play the flute for the girl? Maybe, yeah. Maybe that's it. Oh, it's you. Come on in. Tell me... <laughs> what else can you tell me about the land? Let's talk some more. How goes it, Alexander? Ah, uh, pretty good. What, what else, else can, can you, you tell me about, about the, the land? land? The inhabitants of the Isle of the Sacred Mountain are the most... You want this? Would you be at all interested in this? Nah, what need is a poor dry dock ferryman for that? You think he wants the flute or the... Would you be at all... Nah. You think he wants anything? You want this foot back? I'll give it back. The ferryman gave... He doesn't want it back. You want my ring? Would you be interested in this ring? I don't need charity. I won't take nothing from <laughs> no man till I get back in business and can earn my own key. He's got yoga pants with boots. He's on the cutting edge of fashion. Well... Okay, bye! Yep. You think he wants anything? Let's go back to the shop. Let's try to play the flute out... Okay, let's try to play the flute maybe where that other girl is. What's the paintbrushes per... We'll get... I think we'll get paint later then. Maybe if I play the flute, the lady will come out. <laughs> Just playing a flute. Don't mind me. Alexander plays a lovely little tune on the flute. Hmm, that didn't do anything. It's very hard to click on the edge of the screen. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm. Boring book. There's a book. You think he wants the boring book to read? Maybe he likes the boring book. What else can you tell me about the land? Are we speed? Are we speed at max? We are. Maybe he wants the book. I should have seen if he wants the books. How many ocean deaths? Just two. Two so far. One on purpose. Oh, it's you. One, I, I walked in the ocean at the beginning. Second one, I jumped in after the little boy. I'll... In a pedo moment. Would you be at all interested in this? Nah. What need is a poor dry dock ferryman for that? What? Would you... Nah. You can read it. He gives you something to do if you like reading. Uh, all right. Okay. Do you don't have a lamp? I don't know if we can do anything for the ferryman. I'm not sure about the bookstore. We've got a boring book. We can get a nightingale, a flute, a paintbrush, or a, a tinder thing. A fire tinder thing. Maybe I'm supposed to go back. Is there an area that I can go to that I haven't gone to? Is there something I didn't pick up? Maybe there's something here. Maybe I've got to play the flute here. Luck. We've got the lucky foot. We can get lucky at doing something. Alexander play. I did nothing. He did nothing. If you go in here, the ocean is not as. Yeah, it's got like the weird eerie sound. Hmm. Can't go over there. May, uh, there might be a path. Another path I can take. I'm vaguely remembering there's like a path that I didn't know I could take in this game. And I could when I couldn't advance when I played it as a young child. No older than four or six. Four to six. I was four to six years old when I played this and beat it with no hints. Now I'm 23 and I can't even get even near past the beginning. What if I played the flute for these? What if I went in here and played the flute? There's no reason to put that in the hut. Oh, I can put something in the hut. 
Hey, 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 There's hey! There's no reason to put... There's no... Hey, I can distract those dog shitheads with the bird by putting the bird in the hut. We have the bird. I can distract those... Would you mind... Piece of shit furries. By getting the bird and putting it in the hut. They're like, that why is this bird in here? Very arf, good, arf. Thank you. And then we sneak into the castle and see... And pay our respects to the princess. A.K.A. Bone Down. Bone Down time. Let's go try this. We definitely put something in the hut. Can you give a mild hint? Hmm. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet, Pizzicato. I'm not feeling totally stuck yet. So I'm not sure. There is a- there's a- I already tried to trade the lamp to that guy, Diva, if that's what you're thinking. There's no reason to put that in the- Come on! The mechanical knife- Come the mechanical on! The mechanical- You want a rabbit's foot? I'll cut off your foot, dogs. I really must get inside the castle to see the princess. Perhaps this will convince Stop you. Stop yelling. Be gone! We have no interest in anything you carry. You are not welcome at the castle. Save the pie for the Yeti. How dare you spoil that again, Strahd. What if we give them this boring book? I really must be gone. Uh, I think we got to get the ferry going so we can get to another island. Take it to bingo. Let's think back here. Wait, I can't go this way and I can't go that way. A mild hint. I'm not sure. The narrow path. Not sure. I think we can tr maybe figure this out. Alexander, Fe I think there's something I gotta grab. The bush. The something I need to grab somewhere. The, 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 look! 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 The, the, look! Yeah. Why didn't the bird go in the hut? That's crap, fellow. You know, I agree. I don't have a bone. That's the thing. I don't have a bone. I know they're disgusting, ugly, horrible dogs, but I don't have a bone. I've got a bone to pick with them. Maybe we need the flint thing. Would you mind hey, if various. I traded this in? Are there any bone items? Certainly not. I don't know. Is the flute Alexander. is the flute bone? Look. A plain wooden. A plain wooden flute. A mechanical, a mechanical light, nightingale. A used. A used painter's brush. A battered and a tinder. battered tinder box. Maybe we need to set something on fire. I believe I'll. Very good, sir. Yeah. Thank maybe you. we need to set something on fire. What if we light this guy's robe on fire? Would you be interested in? No. Leave me alone. What if we light this bear on fire? The bear, though a giant in the taxidermy field. No, I'm trying to burn him. I'm not trying to give it to him. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I remember when I had to wait for that wizard to go to bed. That was ridiculous. What if we burn down the bookstore? I think we gotta set something on fire. Good day again. No customers. How may I help you? Maybe we need to re sit here and read this book again. Alexander rests his Alexander picks up and Oh, uh, okay. Maybe I can go to the back of the bookstore. Well, Maybe it's that... got a back a back part. No. Maybe we gotta burn down this There's place. There's no reason to use that on the books. You want the tender box? Merchant. Would you He's be a interested merchant. in this? No, thank you. I deal only in books. I'm gonna give you this horrible book back. Might I return this? <laughs> no. Please, I had a hard enough time getting rid of that book in the first place. If I don't try to burn the hut? Yeah, maybe you need to set a little fire inside the hut. I just kind of feel like I gotta do something with this. Can I just hide here? Alexander. Can I talk to these? These are roses here. Alexander. Alexander's greeted with silence. Let's burn this. There's no reason. Burn this. That. Burn that. There's no. There's a palm tree. The palm trees are beautiful, but neither climbable. Look at this. To take the path, Alexander need only one. Pick up a rock. There's nothing to do there. What's the book about? Alexander's. The book is uh, just a boring book. Alex I think it puts someone to sleep. The pot. I think it's going to put someone to sleep. The pot. The pot cannot be reached by Alexander. There's no reason. We can. But we can put a rabbit's foot in it. Alexander. We can. Yeah, we can talk to this window. Alexander. There is no. Alexander. Damn! There is no. I want to go up to the door and say, knock, Alexander. knock, knock, Ale let me in. Ale Alexander. Wait, I kind of have a feeling I need to go back and forth here and wait until the girl's outside and talk to her. Maybe that's what we need. Come outside. Does Costco have a good return policy? I've never needed to turn it, return anything to Costco because it's too great of a place. Tinderbox. What do I need to light on fire? I don't feel like. Wait, maybe there's. Maybe I need to climb this rope. Alexander would have no use for that rotting rope. Maybe I need to. That boat. Touch the splintery the dock. Alexander has no. He doesn't want to take any of that stuff. Alexander. 
The boat. The, the boat is all in the boat. The splinter. Maybe I can go downstairs in the hold, but we Alexander can't distract the dogs with a painting of a cat. Hmm. I mean, they are dogs, right? So we should be able to distract them in some dogish way. Can I go this way? No, I was thinking almost. Let me talk to this guy some more. Good day, peddler. Good day, sir. If you want to get my new rather bad new <laughs> lamp, you, you need an old lamp. Genie. Maybe there's something Alexander. in one of these. Alexander. Alexander. Alex pots. Alex there's nothing in this pot. It's used as a dump site. Alexander. Costco has a good. Oh, well, every place Alexander. you can pretty much return. Old lamp. You can pretty much return Alexander. anything Al anywhere now. Alex a lamp. Alexander can. Book. There's no point. Maybe there's another book. Maybe there's something on the shelves. Good smoke day, house yeah. out of the hut and then smoke the bird with the face with brush. Ale right now. Fireplace. Thinking of Cosima, uh, Alexander decides uh, to leaf through one of the volumes of love poetry. Uh, he reads, Thy hair, thy lips, whoa. thy beauteous face, the kids to and all thy studied female grace have won for thee anon a place within this broken breast. Breast! Not bad. Pervert. And another. People Upon bring the back shore, dead the trees. Lilies bend, the Costco. Untouched by worldly care. Where shadow they her earthly bed. Oh, that she were not there. That's a porno book. I can't Yikes. understand this. And another. What was it when I looked yeah, at you? Yeah, but the lamp what might have a genie in it, Draconos. He wants a genie and lamp. And binds my heart with links so tight. I cannot live without the sight of you. Hey. Eh? What nameless thing has Shut captured up. me and made me powerless Stop to Stop it, flee? Alexander. What Stop thing reading is this. It without a name that brings my mind air back the same to thee? Knock it off. The name of love cannot apply. Its Stop, commonness does Alexander. not decry the haunted, hunted, painful He's so cry thirsty. that my heart makes for you. That women, ere my soul she, eternal women makes Women don't like poetry. Hmm. A little close to home, that one. Was it? Alexander returns the love poem book to the shelf. So we just learned the love poems. Maybe... Ah, we did need to read those. Puzz, solve, we beta. Puzz, solve. Did it. Alex... Uh-oh. Alex... Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 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 Put it back. What's that? Alexander... Self-help books. Right now. Read about the journeys of others. Alexander isn't interested in the cook A cookie recipe involving cat hair and fish oil. To cooking ever since he experimented with a certain cookie recipe involving cat hair and fish oil. See my stream of my, of King's Quest 3 to know what There's he's talking no about. Reason. Should we talk to this freak again? How fair you merchant? Stop yelling Quite at him. Well, thank you. Boring. All right. Well, we did something we were supposed to do, so we're advancing. Uh, I think it's something with that hut, though. I think we gotta get in the hut and then maybe talk to the princess. And... Then... And then... We need to get driftwood. And then we'll go on our journey. Like, we don't know what we need to do to stop the El Vizier guy, but the princess will tell us when we sneak in. There's no reason to put... There's no... There's no re... There's no reason... These there's bushes. No the bushes are probably not. Hmm. The bush. The bush. The bush. The bush. The bushes. Are, the. It's thundering. Alex, Alexander can't. Something in the hut. It's something in the hut. Yeah. Now we're. Now we're. We've got that love stuff. Or is the red bouncer blue Tony Hawk's Pro Skater too? I like that one. Something in the hut. Poo poo. Touch the hut. The little hut is empty. It's still empty. What's in here? Nothing. The little hut. Something with the hut, man. Alexander. It's not going to be the painter's brush, and it's not going to be the flute in the hut, right? Hmm. All right. I guess I'll. Pizzicato, are you still there? Or did you leave in disgust? I guess I'll take a little hint. I'm not really sure what to do. I'm a little stuck already, and it feels really bad to be stuck already. I feel really bad about myself right now. Pizza. I don't know if it's pizza. Do I need to burn some stuff back here? There's, there's no, there's no Alexander. Why? There's no, there's no. Mm, maybe I, maybe I go to the beach and set a fire on the beach, like a signal fire, and we rescue our men. Poem for the girl in the house, but no, I don't think you would want to. 
love anyone else other than our one true love, which is the girl we met for five minutes in the last game. And we gotta pay our respects to her. Maybe we light this tree on fire. Alexander can see no reason to clamor about on the old tree. He would only scar its bark. Okay, I'm getting, hold on, there's dog people, there's bark here. Dog people, bark, must be tied together somehow. Alexander doesn't, Alexander doesn't see a reason to put that in the tree's hollow. So I can't put anything in this hollow. Alexander, 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 the large fur, the large fur, Alexander, Alexander, Alexander has, Alexander can. Alexander, I think we need to start a fire. Hi, Iomore. Iomore, I think we need to start a fire. What do you think? I think we need to start a fire. There's no reason. There's no reason. Come to, on! There's no reason. There's no Start a goddamn there's fire no, in Pizzicato there's left. No, there's no reason. There's no there's no Wait, what's this little pixel? Alexander has no mm. Alexander moves the plank back to its Something else in this box. Alex a box has been Yeah. Something else is in this box. There's nothing left in the box. And the box yeah, itself pizzicato, is ruined. I'm stuck. You think it has something to do with Alexander? I need a little hint, Pizzicato. There's nothing left. I'm in stuck. The sand. Clap, clap. Boy. Alexander moves the plank. Alexander. There's no re. There's no re. There's no re. Bury. Maybe we need to bury. Uh, the rabbit's foot. There's no reason to. Work on conversation. Not items. Oh. Okay. Let's go talk to the dogs. Okay, yeah. We, that's one thing I haven't really been trying. Talking to everything more. That's... I screwed up. I feel like an idiot. Please. If you'll only be reasonable. I really must see it the does, princess. Iomar. Be does. gone. You're not welcome at the castle, Prince Alexander of Daventry. I have to say we it like that. We have our orders. And they are quite clear. Why do the dogs talk like that? Why aren't they saying, like, bark, bark in the middle of that? Please, if you'll only be reasonable, I really must see the princess. Be gone! You're not welcome at the castle, prince. Okay, I can't can't talk to them. Maybe I need to talk to... I need to yell up there. And love poem her from down here. Yell up there. Hey. Yeah, love poem, go. Alexander's voice simply mm. bounces back. Hey, Vinyl Linen. The windows are closed, and Alexander cannot call through them. No, I didn't, the groves. This area is deserted. There's no one here. I didn't to get talk the T-shaped tool from the toolbox in the small construction tent. Alexander, 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 Alex, Alexander, Alex, 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 Alexander's, Alex, 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 Alexander's. There's there's a rap song you could make with this, if you know how to use the computer music. What if I yell from over here? Talk to the hut. There is no one in the guard hut with whom to communicate. Just gonna stand in here. No, don't talk to them. They stink. Okay, so maybe we need to we need to talk to people. I thought I'd talk to everybody actually. I thought there was nothing else to say. I'm I've talked to the ferryman a lot. Hello. Is anyone in there? There is no reply from the <laughs> hollow in the tree. Alexander, you fool. Oh, maybe we need to talk to the ocean. Hello, is anyone in that hollow in the tree? No. Yeah, damn. The sand does not reply. Talk to the ocean. The currents continue to murmur, but they do not reply to Alexander. What if you went over to here? There's probably some supplies in here. The ship is ruined. It has nothing further to offer Alexander. I think that's being awfully presumptuous. I feel like there would be items in the ship still. Scratch their <laughs> to scratch their tummies. <laughs> Oh, you kids with your computer music. I can make computer music. I might even have some on this computer. Let me see. I might. Let me see. Let's see if I have any of my computer music on this computer. Or maybe I just put it on a hard drive. Let's see. Do I? I used to make a lot of computer music. May, uh, it would be in chiptunes. Do I have a chiptunes folder? Or it's probably in a music folder. Music? C64, no, looks like I don't have it on this computer. Never mind. Never mind. Wait, work, oh, oh. 
Yeah, if it's on this computer, I don't know where it is. I have a folder called Important, and I have no idea what's in it. I'll play it some other time. Well, maybe we talk to the pawn shop guy? We, I think that's the one guy we haven't talked to much. I don't Good think we day. need to ask about the land, though, yeah. Yeah, Haber. Hi, Haber. Haborim. Talk to this guy. Excuse me, merchant, but the ferryman mentioned that you might have oh, a magic map he of the did? land of the Green Isles. Oh, my God! Why, as a matter of fact, I do. I keep it under oh, the counter. Oh, man. It's been gathering dust so long that I nearly forgot about it. Oh, I really screwed it that was up. quite a few years ago, you see. The estate of a wealthy wizard fell into my hands when he died. It was useless magical junk mostly, which reminds me. I've still got some things of his in the back that I need to dump out. I tell you, there's a couple anyway, things I gotta dump out too after the stream. The magic map was the one true treasure in the lot. The wizard was quite old and feeble and had enchanted the map to aid in traveling. Yeah, from it three. It is said that one need only desire to be on an island depicted on the map to find oneself there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is a very valuable map. This is the map, map from King's Quest as Three. As you can imagine. Unfortunately. No one is interested in traveling these days. It is far right? too dangerous with the current state of the kingdom. Why would Sand not what would respond? You take the map? I would normally want something magic in return, but since I am hardly overrun with prospective buyers, it's in the porn I would folder. be willing to take anything of equal value in exchange. Okay. The magic map. That guy see I wasn't I really screwed that up. I didn't I gotta pay closer attention to the conversations. Oh man, shit. Oh, it's awful. We beta. We beta. So he needs something equal exchange. Rabbit's foot is equal. Would you be interested in making a trade for this merchant? Hmm. A rabbit's foot. Ooh. I do not believe I could use that. I guess I gotta give him my signet ring. If Alexander wants to exchange... Would you be willing to take my family ring in exchange for the magic map? Daventry. Are you a king, then? No. That's my father, King Graham. I'm just... Yeah, Alexander. too much Mexican. Vi well, bye, Death Prince Racine. Alex, she is a beautiful ring. Purple Are helps you me. Are sure you can part with such a unique the family man. heirloom? The ring does mean a lot to me. I didn't always have a family, you know. Still... I gotta... I just said I was gonna pay attention gold. to the conversations, and then the I just more didn't. important things at stake now. This is just now own a creepy magic Alexander. Alex. I will keep your ring out of sight for a few days. If you find anything else of great value in your travels, you can come back for your ring. I would hate to see it melted down for gold. Ah, <laughs> and a warning about the map. But I'm going to melt it down right now. When you are out in the open and within sight of the sea, the limitation has something to do with the teleport spell ingredients. You might try the beach. Be better. Thank you. You the man with the purple kind. pants. Rhombus, and I'll good remember hint. about good the hint, map. I did have Mexican food two days ago, and it was delicious. Suddenly, the old man <gasps> in the concealing cloak sneaks past Alexander. No. And with a sneaky dart of his hand, steals a mint from the candy jar. Steals a mint? Oh, it's a mint jar. Oh, I the thought that was the... The um, stuffs the mint into his mouth and wobbles Nightingale. unsteadily out of the pawn shop. Did he steal my map? Sleight of hand? What's wrong with his hand? Did he take it? Master! That's his... I follow Prince Alexander <laughs> as you... I was not expecting this to be his voice. From the pawn shop owner, he just abstained... Uh, just reprieved... Uh, uh, he just got a magic Why map. so drunk? Drunk all the time? Whoa. You fool! Oh, You've it's a been mint. eating those mints again. I ordered you to stop that. Mint makes you drunk? A drunk mint? Or is it yeah. like a THC? Th C mint. No. What is this about a magic map? Where's With the, the map, Prince Alexander could travel anywhere as quickly, quickly Whoa. as this I mint can. fucked him up. I thought I took care of the only means of travel. It's fucked up. By my scimitar. I can't have him stirring things up now. <laughs> By my scimitar. Get hold of yourself and listen carefully, Shamir. Go to the other islands and tell them... Now this game is cool. Alright, thank you Pizzicato for your help, and Rhombus, thank you for your help that said purple. We beta. Whoa, Zonophone! Wait, Zonophone! I thought you already did sub, but you subbed again? 
Thank you, Zonophon. For subbing to the channel. Thank you, Zonophon, for that sub. How you zone? How you zone? How you zone? Hey, Zone, is this a blind run? Okay, I owe more. Here's the deal. I played this game pretty much when it came out as a young child, and I don't remember very much of it. However, I did the same thing that was King's Quest V, and I had a bunch of subconscious memories come back to me. So it's kind of blind, kind of not. Good. Now, here's the thing. We got the magic map. I don't think we're supposed to bring this. I think we're supposed to bring the bird. So I'm going to bring the Would bird. Would you mind if... Of course, Prince Alex, please. <laughs> tell, them, tell them he's got a small penis. Good. Yeah, that's probably what he told them. Uh, that mechanical. Probably, he's hot. He, probably that good, guy probably went you. around and said, told everyone Alexander has a small penis. Mint. Alexander. It's a drunk. Oh, so the mint makes the guy drunk. So we can probably when we go up against him, we'll probably have to throw a mint in his face. Alexander already. Throw the mint in his mouth. Perfect throw. <laughs> And now, I don't understand why the mint makes him fall- uh, Is it because it's alcoholic? You reprimed up. Okay, thanks, Zonophone, for, for thinking of me. Thank you for w watching the stream, and hopefully you like the stream. Hopefully you have fun watching the stream. Yeah, but this game is great so far. I'm glad we're playing this, though. It's real good. It's This game's real good so far. It's just, oh man, can you hear that? There's a big thunder outside. If um, if the stream ends, I think we're still bit. We can still do wee beta. If the stream ends, I'll come back as soon as I can. My power doesn't normally go out. Sometimes it goes out for like a quick second. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Iomor, look. Here's my map of the desert. I mapped out the desert. This is my map of the desert. See right here. You can't read it. But that's where the that's where you get shanked at those tents, and that's the desert fortress. I mapped out the desert. It wasn't that bad. I owned King's Quest V. I destroyed King's Quest V. I just heard a beep. I don't know what the beep was. I heard a beep and then a real loud thunder clap. Did you hear that? Alexander pulls out his magic map. I'm. S that was really loud. Oh. <gasps> Did you hear that, Mr. Radon? You heard it? <laughs> monk ass. That was very monk ass. Um, yeah. That was like, that looked right out. Let's go. I gotta look out the window. Make sure my house is still here. Damn. It rains like crazy around here lately. It's awful. It's like big thunderstorms all the time, and I'm trying to mow the damn lawn. Luckily, I got ahead of it this week. Whew. This game's fun. I like this game. All right. Um, go outside. IRL stream outside. Good idea. So where are we right now? We're on the Isle of Wonder? No, we're on the Isle of the Crown. Let's go to the Isle of the Beast. No, let's go to the Isle of Wonder. Alexander feels a strange pulling sensation. <laughs> you know, he wants to go meet Cassandra and feel a strange pulling sensation, if you know what I mean. The window's not open to Kanja. That was a close thunderclap. I, sh I almost want to go check on my wife. I don't know what the beep was. Why did I hear a beep? I heard a beep somewhere in here and then a thunderclap. What was that? My do I have like a thunder warning in here? Isle of Wonderman. Isle of Wonderman. Sleeping clams. Why aren't you asleep like the other? The window's right here. Yeah. Oh, I'm so weary, but I can't sleep. I have a terrible ache in my mouth. Yeah, I got pants on. Uh, if I if I reach like this with my arm outstretched this far. I can touch the window. <laughs> Alexander feels a strange pulling sensation, and he looks down, and he's grabbing his dingling. Uh... Oh, Alexander Graham Clay. What's wrong? You got a toothache? I've got a bite. That won't do anything for the little oyster. I've got a little bite. There's no reason to use that on the distant <laughs> foliage. 
I want to use... There is no reason... I want to use this book on the distant foliage. There is no reason to use that on the distant foliage. There is a reason. You just don't get it. What's wrong with your mouth? <laughs> no offense, but it hurts too much to talk. <laughs> the voices are good in this game compared to the last one. What's wrong with your mouth? Oh, that's no what it was. Offense, but it hurts too much to talk. Maybe it was, uh, I don't have a UPS. I should get one. That's a good thought, Dracunos. I should get a UPS. Maybe that's what was beeping, but I don't actually have one, so I don't know how that would have been what was beeping. Maybe this power strip I have counts as a UPS? <laughs> Probably not, said the man who understands nothing about the world. Now, what's this? Alexander picks oh! up the object floating in the water. It appears to be a string of letters. They say, where are you going? Yeah. Alexander decides to keep the odd sentence, even though it is incomplete. It's Webby from DuckTales. Okay, so we've got an incomplete sentence that says, where are you going? All right, I like, I love finding There's things. There's no reason. Alexander doesn't. Now this game has real obscure stuff, right? Alexander hears someone coming. Uh-oh. I tell you, he wants to go find Cassandra and then hear someone coming, if you know what I mean. All right, that's getting, it's going a little too far. Five fierce guards of the aisle we be. Watch for a foreign man, said he. Oh. With ears and nose, tongue, hands, and eyes. Ears? If nature cannot be disguised. Mouth, eyes, if hands, be, then nose. Man, it dies. We got it. Whoa, 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 hold on. Old Tom Troll, smell your smell. Do that which you do so well. This is cool. He's gonna smell me? Oh, oh, st wait, 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 wait. Getting smelled. Do I have the thing? I need to stop the smell. Uh, I think you must need five items. I'm guessing this is how it works. You need five items to change all their senses, to, d to confuse their senses, and then you can get past them. I'll give him the rabbit's foot. Alexander holds the item out for the gnome with the stupendous nose. Oh, maybe it was my modem. I don't know. My nose cannot be tricked that way. Oh. The smell of man still rules the day. This is cool. A man, a man so sad knows, into the waiting sea he goes. Alright, well we've got enough saves, so <laughs> they just... You could run away, Alexander. There's a thing about the Graham and Alexander, they don't know how to just run away. I don't think these guys could catch them. I mean, only one can even see me. And we could probably fight that the one. Gnomes toss Alexander too far out into the sea for him to get his footing. But Alexander just wants to stand under. there as he lets a thing smell him. And he lets them all line up in a line and they smell him instead of just running away. All right. Oh, yeah. We're drowning. Okay. We're still drowning. It takes a while to drown. Real time drowning. Uh, getting smelled. Uh, Isle of Wonder, Mon. So we can't go here, Mon. We've got to leave, Mon, and this person has a toothache, Mon. We gotta get that. Alexander, wait. Don't die. The ocean currents. Ooh. Then we'll wait till it gets closer. I guess we didn't talk to this thing. Why? Yet. Oh. You got a terrible egg in your mouth. You want this mint? That won't do anything for the little oyster. No good. Oh man, is. Wait, now it's over there. What does it take to get that over here? Why is it over there now? The ocean is. N no, no, no. Talk to it again. What's wrong with your mouth? No offense, but What's wrong it hurts with your too much ugly to mouth? Talk. What's wrong with your mouth? Why is that over there now? How, I don't get it. Is it just different? Why? Why is that over there now? What if I load the game? Does it change every time I load? Seems like it did. Did it? I could get that before. Now I can't get that. The ocean is not. You remember the, the items? Ocean. Good. Oh, we're doing no hints, though. I'm just saying. If, you, if you're new to the stream, we do no hints. I'm scared. Alexander. I should put no hints in the furry's welcome. Take away furry's welcome. Uh, no hints. Got to put no hints just to be careful, you know. That's cool, though. I am where I don't remember them. I played this game as a kid, but I don't remember. Alexander doesn't need to carry around the dead weight. Of Why can't I teleport? Alexander Alexander pulls out his magic map. Good. I could have been bad. Let's go back to Alexander. the Isle of the Crown. Furry's gone. Furry's not welcome anymore. There's no more furries. There's only furries in the uh in the castle. 
Okay, let's use the map again. Let's see, what else would trick him? Maybe the, the sound, this would trick the sound one. Alexander. The flute, I don't know what that's for. The tinder box, I don't know. Alexander. I want to get that string of words. It's still far away. What the hell, man? Why is it far away now, man? Alexander wades in the ocean currents. Get it. Alexander wade the underwater to And it just Ale dies. Alexander got killed. Whoops, don't save. I don't get why it's far away now. It wasn't far away before, but now it is far away. Hold on, maybe we gotta leave from here. Alexander. Let's go while they're trying to smell me. There we go. Okay, and we have the thing. Perfect. Let's go to the Isle of the Beast. Alexander feels a strange pulling sensation. <laughs> Isle of the Beast. Alright, now we're good. There's a little fawn over there. And we got the words? Okay, perfect. Save. Save over, uh... Let's call it Isle of the Beast. Isle of, Isle of the Beast. Beast one. Let's talk to the fawn. The fawn is too busy eating to pay attention to Alexander. So can we talk to animals in this one, just like King Graham? The denseness of the forest makes it inadvisable to stray from the path. Oh, I was just clicking on this because it looks like a bow. Alexander has no need to carry around large rocks. It says it very emphatically. Don't pick up rocks. The trees have small, sparse branches on their lower trunks. They don't lend themselves to easy climbing. Well, I was just clicking because it looks like it's a hole. Damn. Alexander resists the temptation to pet the fawn, thinking he might frighten it. All right, how about inside this tree trunk? If the tree stump is hiding anything, it's only local fauna. There's no need to disturb some creature's nest. All right, what about these roots? The denseness of the forest. Uh, okay. Alexander. All right, Alexander. Tall, narrow... Okay, all right, nothing here. Alexander is standing here at the edge of the sea on a heavily forested island. As far as the eyes can see, tall trees spread out their branches as though straining to link arms, their tops forming a canopy above. A path leads north through the forest. So this is like a jungle area. The Isle of the Beast. Where all the beasts are. Rabbit. Alexander can't talk to animals? Alexander isn't quite lonely enough to talk to a rabbit. I think he is. If he's trying this hard to just meet a lady that he... to see a lady again that he met for five minutes, but I guess, you know, what happens? Take the- Oh, no! Ouch! That water is- No, I clicked on that mushroom. I didn't click on the water. Alexander, not being an expert on poisonous mushrooms, decides <laughs> not to take a chance on tasting the local variety. The father and son both are go on journeys to find a lady in a tower. It's how- Is this how the this family- I see the lamp here. Is this how this family meets their wives? They have to go see them in a tower in a mirror? I mean, this is the same exact storyline. I don't get how they couldn't come up with something different. The denseness of the forest makes it inadvisable to stray from the path. Like, it could have just been, like, the magic mirror shows that the princess has been kidnapped or something. Wouldn't have to be, like, uh, the, the lady in the tower again. It is a condescending narrator. Alexander, not being an expert on poisonous mushrooms, decided... Very condescending. Alexander doesn't need that, a.k.a. don't click it again. Alexander if you click it again, you're a moron. The denseness... The tall, narrow... Okay, so we got some hat water here. Hmm. Hmm. The denseness of the four... Hmm. The tall, narrow... Hat water. We got a lamp. An old, abandoned hunter's lamp is hanging on one a of the lamp. trees. By novice. Alexander wonders who might have hunted in these dense woods. They're into tower ladies. Could be. Maybe they just, uh, it's like a, it's like, it's like a genetic thing, or it's like, uh... I mean, he is his father's son, so maybe... As Alexander was growing up, I mean, I know technically that Alexander didn't grow up with Graham, but maybe it's like in in his DNA to want to find a woman like his mother, you know, a tower woman. To get to the lamp, Alexander must first cross the pond. All right, let's give it a shot. Let's watch ourselves boil alive. Alexander decides to break no, the boiling don't do pond. It. No, Alexander, no. I'm not sure that's what would and happen. And soon realizes a deep sympathy for soup vegetables as he learns the true meaning of being in a stew. I don't think he would sink in it. I think it would get really hot and he would get burned and he would back up. I don't think he would fall into it. Unless it, it's got it's real deep here. Like if you put your hand in boiling water, you just immediately go back. You don't like continue. You don't like submerge yourself into it and let yourself get boiled to death. Do you? Unless you're a psychopath. Okay, what would help here? Fire, 
I, I don't think this is where we're supposed to go. I think we gotta leave. I don't think we have anything that can get across this. We need ice. We need some the powers of ice. Let's try the other map. Alexander pulls out his magic map. Well, like in his pants. It's common to meet woman in tower. Yeah, that is the internet dating. You see a woman in a tower in a magic mirror. Mm-hmm. A volcanic bath. Hmm. Alexander feels a strange pulling <laughs> He's sensation. He's like John from Garfield. Yeah. Throw in the fawn. Yeah, let's get the fawn. Step on the fawn's body to get across. Oh, he's got no pain. <laughs> he feels no pain. He's got that uh, no pain disease. Alexander the cooling mint. The, the mint is cooling. We got a feather, though. Now we got a feather, though. Alexander is carrying an unusually large black feather. Come on. Get out of here. Alexander picks an unusually the flower and large is black by feather. a hideously strong skunk-like odor. Ah. For a moment, he can smell nothing else. That's for the nose guy. That's for the nose gnome. Let's save again. Not I Love the Beast. I'm going to save over I Love the Beast because we did nothing here. Isle of the fourth one. I forget what it's called. That's, now, I think these are some words to read. There appears to be something etched into the face of the cliff. I've got the reference card, Alexander Rhombus. decides to get closer. Ignorance kills. Wisdom elevates. I-K-W-E. Ignorance kills. Wisdom elevates. The rock has been etched by some unknown <laughs> hand. One may need to read about the Logic Cliffs in the guidebook to the Land of the Green Isles in order to understand this mystical inscription. Oh, okay. This is, um... This is the copy protection? I've got it right here. I'm looking at it right here. Look, you don't believe me? Right here! But it's a genuine copy of the game which I bought on Steam. Yeah, I got it right here, Rhombus. Okay, ignorance kills, wisdom elevates, but I don't understand. I still don't know what I'm supposed to do. The rock has... The rock... The rock says... The rock has... Says shut your damn mouth. The rock has... Says shut your damn mouth. Oh. Whoops. Oops. Okay. Uh... Uh-huh. Leave. Nothing happened. Is this, uh... There appears to... Ignorance kills, wisdom elevates. Um... Oh, I was looking at the wrong thing. Okay, I thought that... I thought... The top is King's Quest 4, then it's King's Quest 5, then it's King's Quest 6. I didn't have to use these, by the way. So, King's Quest 6. What do I have to do? I this Is this this part? Ignorance. Kills. Am I supposed to do it? Wouldn't it tell me? Ignorance. Kills. No? Oh. Iamor says no. Okay. So I gotta figure out what to do with that. But you gotta read in the Green Isles guidebook. Alexander. Let's use this book on this. That has no using that on the Yeah, I don't know. It's in the full King's Quest 6 manual. Really? Okay. Let me see. King's Quest manual. King's Quest Collection. Okay, yeah, I've got the manual right here, too. Look, it's the real manual. Look at this. Okay, King's Quest 6. Here we go. King's Quest. Hair today, gone tomorrow. I tell you, you lose your hair, it's gone tomorrow. It feels like it's just gone here today, and it's gone tomorrow. Okay, let's read this. Let's make this bigger. I can barely see it. I can barely see this thing. Isle of the Sacred Mountain. A pair of greeters. What? Isle of Wonder, no. Something about the Green Isles. The Isle of the Sacred Mountain. I don't think that's what I need to do. The Ancient Ones. I'm not reading this. The Ancient Ones Alphabet, no. The Logic Cliffs. Ah, here we go. The Logic Cliffs. One of the most intriguing artifacts are the Logic Cliffs. They're a series of riddles. Chiseled painstakingly into the rock, the viewer must question what purpose the words serve. From the ancient scroll that references the cliffs can be determined that the riddles on the cliff were part of an elaborate mechanism designed to protect those who dwelt at the top of the cliffs. Whatever the cliff's purpose was, it was built only to admit only those indoctrinated into the secrets of the Ancient One's culture. 
The first challenge, only those pure of heart will be able to rise the cliffs of logic. Easy enough. Puzz whiz. I can puzz whiz that all day long. Did I save? Okay. Rise. R. I. S. First one. Huge blocks of stone of erupt hey, from the station. granite cliffs. Thanks, Grombus. I would never have known that that was I was. That's what I was supposed to do. Now we got the steps. Got to spell out a word like dongs. Man, so you, you have to read the manual. Alexander stares with wonder. Damn, if Rhombus wasn't quite here, a way to welcome a guest. If indeed maybe Pizzicato would have told welcome. me. But otherwise, we would have gotten stuck. Now I can climb up these. Rise to the occasion. I hope Alexander can rise to the occasion. The steps cannot be moved. No, I want to climb on them. The steps. No, I don't want to move them. I want to climb on them. Go. Are we dead ending? I guess you gotta read the manual. I guess I'll make sure I read the manual for King's Quest Sip. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Tipster. Tipster face. Whoa. New riddle. New riddle time. Don't fall. You can do it. Don't be a thing where you can fall randomly. Thank you. Let's rise to the occasion, guys. Alexander examined. A master of languages will shit. So we gotta spell shit. It doesn't even tell you about the second challenge. A master of lang- Oh, why did it say challenges? Languages. A master of languages will... I don't know, rise? It just says the third challenge now. A master of languages will. Uh, and then I've got to choose a symbol. I don't know what the word is. Is it rise? Is it rise again? R. Do I have to do rise? <laughs> a master of languages will shit is my first in, uh, instinct. But that could be wrong. That might not be correct. I mean, it could be a master of languages will live it looks i'm looking for one that looks like a cup here it is maybe it's rise again would they use rise twice now i'm looking for one that looks like a little man that's it and then e is like a little foot rise that wasn't it master of languages will talk it could Nothing be it could be talk Alexander. a master of languages will speak talk could it be talk I'm your favorite anime. Thank you. I am an anime. Hey, Rough Galaxy. Welcome to the anime show. Look at the manual again. Manual Lewis or the Ancient One's Alphabet? Okay, I'm looking at... Let's look at the manual together again. A master of languages will soar. I saw that right away because that's what the puzzle luck gets you. See, right, right there. Right there. Right. Look top right. Can you see my cursor? Probably not. Look at the top right. I'll highlight it. Are you looking at it? A master of languages will soar. My eyes went right to that, because that's the power of the puzzle. It's real. People still don't believe in it because it's something they don't understand. But the power of the puzzle is real. Puzz luck is real. Puzz whiz power is real. S. Now we're looking for a weird face. O. A. Is like a box. Uh, this type of box. A. And then R. Is a little flying thing. The little flying thing is here. Oh, wait. Yep. The stone beneath Alexander's yeah. feet trembles. Hey, Flay Alice, how are you? Steps emerge from the granite cliffs. Yeah, we're we're we are rising to this challenge. Doesn't count. This is an anime. What's this? She'll ever see water again. <sighs> why are the islands feuding? Remember this, guys. Something about stolen property or something. Remember when I whistled and it made everyone mad? Things used to be so friendly. You wanna watch that again? Rest is recent. Hold your fire linked it. But it's been long enough. Perhaps if you need a reminder at how good of a how good of a streamer I am? There you go. I wanna I wanna whistle some more. Whistling is fun. How can you not whistle? I have a manual at home. I do. I have a uh, uh, an e manual. Lewis at home. The grows. Is Emmanuel Lewis dead or is that the other one. The other guy. Oh my god, that sounded bad. Is that the other guy? There's Emmanuel Lewis, and then there's, um... There's Emmanuel Lewis, and then there's, uh... Guy from Growing Pains. No, the guy from Different Strokes. Uh, what's his name? 
He was in Postal 2. Uh, yeah, Flyos. Yeah, uh, King's Quest 4 and 5 were easier than I thought. I mean, I did get a... I think I got, like, maybe one or two hints. I think King's Quest 5 only needed one hint. I did only need one hint in 5, I think. 4, I needed one or two, though. Gary Coleman, there you go. They're both dead. Alexander they're both, they're both dead? It sucks to be dead, guys. You gotta make sure you guys live your lives before you die, okay? The third challenge. The stones of stealth are associated with this riddle. The four men standing in a row. Third from the left and down you go. The rest in order. Move yon. The oldest, the youngest, the second son. Okay. Okay, so third from the left. One, two, three. Alexander what? Hey! Oops. I didn't save! Remember when I whistled during Kingsfield? No. Why am I the worst? I haven't saved. I didn't. Oh, I did save. I haven't saved since I was at the bottom. Horrible. All right, let's watch this clip. Let's watch this clip. Here's the this? stream lore about me and my wife. We've no, out. shut up, Dave. I don't know what happened. Oh. See, I don't know how that stream. Don't click on that clip. Damn it. I hate you. I hate you. Dave, I hate you, in particular. Uh, I don't even know why I said that. I just say random things sometimes. It's I don't know what was going on with me there. When you stream a lot, sometimes random things come out of your mouth. All right, so now we got it. What are we looking for again? We're looking for... All right, we're looking for the little man. We're looking for the face. Then we're looking for the box. And then this. The stone... Nailed it. How you doing, Flayos? Thanks, Flayos. Hi, Flayos. Not the chubby bitch. I don't care about the chubby bitch. I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna allow it to... I'm not going to allow this to pervade this... this... Uh, this uh, family-friendly stream any longer. We're playing a family-friendly game. No one knows what I'm talking about. It said third from the left, though, and that was wrong? I guess I gotta read that riddle better. Okay, let's save a new save, because we might not be supposed to come up here. Climbing. That says climbing to me. Okay. Manuel. Emmanuel Lewis. Emmanuel Gary Coleman. Lewis. Four men standing in a row. Third from the left. Oh. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. Third from the left and down you go. Okay. I don't know why I didn't make the connection that down you go meant if you click on that you will fall. Instead, when I heard third from the left and down you go, I thought, yes, that's the one I need to press. The rest in order, move you on. The youngest, the oldest, and the second son. Okay, so that means that I do Alexander the youngest, the oldest, and the second son. And then the and then this one or what? Alexander. Get oh no, that was wrong. The oldest, the youngest, and the second son. Alexander. Well, who's the oldest? You just want it to be in order? No. Alex. Uh huh. I did it. The oldest. Whoops. <laughs> All right, that was a good death. You thought there's a hair on your screen? Where? What? What's the hair? What's the hair you think's a hair? Alexander examines the strange etchings in the face. There was a fight in Godcom chat about how having to click on each individual stone is bad. I mean, it's, I mean, it took me like, I don't, yeah, I don't, that's a bit extreme. I mean, it took me like 10 seconds, maybe. Graham, full name is Graham Cracker. I did do that to Kanji. Somebody said that. The rest in order move you on. The youngest, the oldest, the second son. So is this the youngest, the oldest, and the second son? The stone beneath right, Alexander's we had feet it. trembles Wrong. Who was the youngest and who was the oldest? From the granite cliffs. Granite cliffs. Don't take life for granite, guys. Yeah, it's probably a pube. Like, true. The gross. Thanks for helping. Hold your fire. Let's see how long this takes. And if this is worth even talking about. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
Wow, this is fun to click on these. I'm not counting anymore. This is just fun. I like clicking on these. And it plays a little sound. Do 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 Okay, the fourth challenge is not in the book, so it must be a different paragraph. Alexander examined. Oh, okay, sacred four. All right, well, can I? I can't search this, right? Can I? Sacred four. Can I search the doc? No, because it's... Sometimes you can search things that aren't text, but... Okay, now we're looking for the sacred four. The sacred four. And then the next thing is ascend, okay? We're looking for the sacred four something. Everybody look for sacred four. Everyone scan this document for the words sacred four. Right now, or get out. Sacred four. Tranquility, azure... Caterpillar air. Okay, found it already. So what we have to do tranquility azure. Wait, tranquility azure caterpillar air. So now we have to go back here. Tranquility azure. Whoops. Oops, that's that's better. That's better. Tranquility azure. Pop something air. Tranquility is here's azure. O is the second one. Tranquility is D. D-O-N-G, probably. D-O-N-G. Tranquility air, caterpillar air. Tranquility... <laughs> Tranquility azure, caterpillar air. Caterpillar. D-O. Where's caterpillar? Q? D-O-Q? That's not how you spell dong. D-O-Q, caterpillar. And then air. Air is... Scan it, scan it. G. Oh, oh it is dong, but it's like medieval... Dong, where like N's or Q's, so D O Q G, Dong. It literally is Dong. But it's medieval Dong. Little known fact, they used to write D's as Q, I mean N's as Q's. Okay, so D is little crown, O is little face, N slash Q is little steps, and G is big old lines and a dot. The stone beneath -G. Alexander's feet dong. trembles it's dong. as more steps emerge from it's the granite cliffs. It's not one letter off dong, it's medieval dong. Scat. I'm a scat, scat. Be ba 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 da ba. Oh yeah, I love scat man. Love him. I would not clothesline him and knock him out of the ring like I did to Hulk. Hulk deserved it. Scatman wouldn't deserve it. Rest in peace. I love Scatman. Oh, yeah. He's the best. And at WrestleMania 5, I'm going to show why he's the best with my tribute to Scatman. Skibbidibidib doom 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 doom. Oh, doom 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 doom. Skibbidibidib doom 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 doom. Be ba 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 da ba. Skibbidibidib deep 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 deep. Well, I'm a Scatman. Awesome, Macho Man. Who knew Macho Man loves Scatman so much? The thing is, I heard Macho Man likes anyone else with the name. With the, with the word man in their name. He just naturally gravitates towards those people. Be -ba 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 -da -ba. One of the highest order may ascend the Cliffs of Logic. Let's make another save because we are ascending the Cliffs of Logic. Do you even get anything up here? Probably, right? I hope there's a quick way up and down. Now, hold on. Flaos, are you still watching? If you have to click on the stones all the way up and all the way down every time, then I see why there was an argument because that's bad. Alexander a. Wait. Ascend. A. S. C. E. N. The stone beneath Ding. Alexander's feet azure? trembles it's azure. as more steps azure. emerge from the granite cliffs. Azure. Dong. Dong. D-O-N-G. WrestleMania 5 SummerSlam at the Royal Rumble. I'm gonna be the last man standing. That's my, that's my impression of Macho Man. Not very good. Not very good at impersonating Macho Man. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, this is the real Macho Man coming at you from Retro Game Tom's bedroom. Whoa, wait a minute. Uh-oh, go back to the game. Macho Man, you sounded like me for a second. Whoa, he, he almost fell. You get nothing. It'd be funny if I get nothing. Maybe you just get points. There is a quick way down. SummerSlam is next month at WrestleMania 5. Uh, Macho Man... Whoa, it's the evil guy. Glowing eyes. Macho Man did one of his best promos for WrestleMania 5. You want to watch it? Exhausted, he steps over the lip of the plateau and stands. He made it. We made it, guys. Why do you make such an effort to climb the cliffs, young man? The winged ones who live on this island have the power of flight. 
This game's really cool. You could have it too if you'd only eat a berry from this magical flying nightshade bush. <laughs> I'm not an idiot. Alexander, you're not an idiot, right? Don't do it. Okay, I don't really want to fly like that. See? Looks goofy. The sweet berries will make you float like a petal on the wind. No, nah, I'll pass. Try some. Hey, Bry Guy. Well, it's a guy pretending to be a girl in the game, so the voice kind of makes sense there. Alright, we made it. No, I'm not gonna try some. If I click on it, do I eat it and die, or do I just pick it up? Alright. I'll try some of your berries. Yes, try some of my berries, young man. Oh, goody. Eat quickly, dear boy, and I'll show We're you the way to the world We're gonna get high off these berries. Lady of this isle. What? Oh. <laughs> Slightly bitter, pretty one. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. If this guy... Oh. I know you come here later. Here's the thing, if that guy wants me dead, he's got crazy magic powers, why doesn't he just, you know, teleport behind me and kill me? How about I give you a mint? Comes. No, I'm giving you a mint. Would you care for a mint? Mint? Really? Ooh. I think that's a dead end, unless I get points. <laughs> Crack, smack, slobber, yum! He's drunk. <laughs> I wonder if I was supposed to do this or not. He left. How odd. That woman simply disappeared. Um, we didn't get points, I don't think. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not. I'm thinking not. And maybe can I, I, I can probably go get another mint later Alexander decides to try no just pick one up don't have to eat everything you touch <gasps> you don't have to eat everything you touch I'm not sure about giving the mint to this to this lady I don't watch wrestling anymore but I agree that it used to be great with characters such Come as Razor straight. Ramon and Doink the Clown all right we'll go to this obvious door over here instead I'm gonna turn down we take the speed down one right Talk to the lady. But who are you, Matron? You can get okay. more mints. Uh, I, I mean, I am only a poor old woman who wishes you well, handsome stranger. Think of me as your grandmama, if you like. No, my favorite wasn't the big boss man. My favorite was Mr. Perfect, Razor Ramon, Brett the Hitman Heart, Doink the Clown. I just remembered, oh, I, I have a little man. Hulk. Stay tied to the ground like a load of lead. See if I care. You, 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 human. Bye. So I have 31 points. Did I get points? I'm going to make a new save. A new save. Done climb. Done climb. How odd. And I'm going to make, a, I'm going to go from the old save and give him a mint and see if I get points. I have 31 points. Would you? Honky Tonk Man, no, I didn't like Honky Tonk Man, I didn't like Sergeant Slaughter, I didn't oh, like Big Boss Man. No, no points. How odd. How odd. Let's go in here. Mr. Perfect was cool, Razor Ramon was cool too, because he threw a toothpick tight. in people's face. Somebody obviously wants to and they got really mad. Out or something in. So we've got to figure out how to get through these doors. I don't really have a way to get in, I can talk to the doors. There's no... The heavy doors give away nothing. Bret Hart, the Hart family, it was in your from your hometown. Yeah, they're from Canada. The Hart, the Hart family is kind of like depressing. Alexander crawls oh. through the small opening in the rock. Really, I can crawl through that hole? Okay. Luckily, I clicked there. It's not very obvious. Look, I can climb Alexander in here. Alexander finds himself in a dark cave. It's light it up, light her up. Oh, I didn't bring the thing. Yeah, I don't think you're supposed to climb, crawl through here. Can I make another save? Here. I'm gonna die if I go in the dark. It's just not smart to go in somewhere in the dark. I can see, but it's not- Dead end. Dead end. Since it's so dark, Alexander- Since it's so dark, Alexander can't do much inside the cave. Does Ethiopia have a big wrestling scene, the Gros? 
the best there is, the best there was, Alexander and the best there ever will be. We need to go get the Tinder thing. We need to go on Tinder. We could walk over here at least. We need to go on Tinder and swipe An right. Hold! How did you get up here, The human? winged ones. It's not I lit, fam. Climbed the cliffs. That is not possible. No one has solved the cliffs of logic in several centuries. And if the cliffs were to be solved, it would certainly not be by a human. Well, it was. I, I didn't mean to trespass. I only wanted to visit this beautiful island. No visitors have been welcome on the Isle of the Sacred Mountain in years. Not since the Red and White Queens had spies in the guise of friendly visitors steal our island's sacred golden fleece. But we will not display such foolish trust again. You will have to answer to Lord Azure and Lady Ariel. They will determine what will be done with you. I can assure you, it will not be pleasant. Why are these guys such dicks? Ric Flair? Yeah, Ric Flair's cool. But I like people. I like someone that had a real goofy persona. I mean, I guess they those guys did With what have a goofy trickery persona. Did you master the cliffs of logic and reach the city of the winged ones? My own brain. Only the magic of clear thought, my lord. I meant no harm. The cliffs of logic. It is the sacred oracle's prophecy, <laughs> Azure. Yeah, why do they have that gate? Yes, Ariel. They can just fly over it. It is lucky for you, human, that climbing the Cliffs of Logic is part of a prophecy that I cannot ignore. Put the kids to bed. I had the manual. We have <laughs> just been ordered by Wazir al Hazred himself to dispose of any strangers that might land on our fair isle. But the prophecy would have a different fate. G-Force game-ready drivers available. The prophecy Good news. predicts that whosoever climbs the Cliffs of Logic will defeat the Minotaur. I say what? The Minotaur has violated our sacred catacombs and eats our young in sacrifice. Our own daughter, Lady Celeste, was taken there only this morning as his most recently demanded offering. I say what? A dilemma then. Whom shall I obey in regards to your fate? The Oracle or the Crown? But since al Hazred did not dictate how I was to dispose of intruders, and since you cannot possibly survive the catacombs, your imprisonment there should serve both purposes. Why do you have admirably. to listen to al Hazred? What's great I so will great not about resist him? You in this, my lord. I shall do my best to save your daughter. Damn, just hmm. get thrown into First, stuff. I must tell you that the catacombs are a labyrinth of rooms, a place of exceeding danger. You will need many tools and clear wits to survive. Do I have the tools? Azure, he must be allowed time to prepare for the task, if only in the slight chance that he could actually save our Celeste. Oh, very I well. I probably don't have the Intruder, tools. Intruder, my guards will take you to the beach. Prophesied hero or spy, any soldier must be granted time to prepare for battle. My driver's available. Be warned. If you have the courage to actually return to the Isle of Are the you Sacred sure I'm Mountain dead ended? and face I can come back destiny, here later. My guards will have orders to take you to the catacombs on site. We need site. to collect everything we can and come back here when we think we have enough you. tools. If by some miracle Yeah, how about not succeed, giving away your daughter, human, idiots? The prophecy grants you a visit with the Sacred Oracle. Her powers are mighty. Her vision all-seeing. This is like how you talk to people. Many of our own citizens would be willing to risk certain death in the catacombs for a chance at a meeting with the Oracle. May that thought give you the courage to return. You just sit here on your stone oh, thrones will return, and talk Lady down Aria. to people. You have my word. And Alexander eats it up. I love these guys who are going to throw me into a minotaur labyrinth. But at least let me prepare. Come back later. All right, we come back later. But we're not actually dead-ended, only if we come back, right, Pizzicato? Uh, Hacksaw Jim Duggan Danzilla, yeah, he was alright. Doesn't he do a thing where he, like... What, didn't he go like this, like, when he was weak? Hacksaw Jim Duggan would go like this a lot. And he would, like, come back. Like, he would go like this, and then everyone would be like, No, he's doing the thing! And you go like, Ugh! And he would, like, clothesline you, right? Isn't that what he did? Hacksaw Jim Duggan power. Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Uh, special move. Am I allowed to show this? Yeah, I can, I can go back into the hole. But we gotta go get the, uh... 
I mean, we don't. We can just come back later. I can't go back up here anymore. I can just go up. Wait, I'll just go back to. Uh... I mean, we need to leave to get something in the hole anyway. So, uh, if I climb up, I mean, this, this. Okay, I see why people were annoyed about climbing these steps now, Flaos. He had the board enchanted USA while he stomped the football tackle clothesline. Didn't you go like this? Oh, we're at the top, and then we get taken right to the... Oh, okay. We, Pizzicato was right. So, you Rhombus, Pizzicato knows more than you about this game. Do you feel bad about that? So, Since it's so, so we can't go that way. Rhombus, you were wrong. Alexander, I am dead-ended. Okay, so we have to climb down. I see why, yeah. This is... It's no good to click on these stones. I shouldn't have come up here. This was a bad idea. Now we've got to click on these stones. To get down. Ethiopian National Bank. Oh, hey, Ethiopian National Alexander Bank. Clark. Oh, look, you don't have to click on them all. This is great. This is fine. Ethiopian National Bank. How are you? Uh, the Ethiopian wrestling scene. Yes, somebody did earlier. Somebody mentioned that earlier, Ethiopian National Bank. <laughs> um, do you have a friend named Ethereal Pies by any Alexander chance? Alexander climbs carefully down the long... Ethiopian National Bank. <laughs> they're doing outreach in Twitch streams. Alexander. The Ethiopian National Bank. They're trying to go go big. You do you want to sponsor me? Alexander feels a strange pulling sensation. I tell you. WWF stream. Yeah, the thing is I don't I, I'm pretty sure you're really not supposed to show that on, on your stream. Look, you're really not supposed to show this on your stream. Probably, right? Monty Bamlet on HG presents the top 15 moves of Hacksaw. Club to neck. We can just show one, right? Nice. That was, that was, <laughs> that was a special move. Going like this. Uh, wrestling started off really boring. Uh, yeah, Geister, I know. Piranha Bytes is coming out with a new game. It's called Elix, and I forget what the release date is. What is it? Oh, what happening? Dumping stuff? You dumping stuff? What'd you dump? What you dumping there? What you dumping in there? Alexander sorts through the odds and ends that the pawn shop owner dumped into the pot. Magic exploding gum wrappers. A shattered crystal. Come on, something good, something good. A cracked wand. A fake thumb. Hmm. The top 15 special the moves, hitting someone Alexander on the head. finds a little glass bottle labeled ink. ink. It appears to be empty, but Alexander decides to take it anyway. You never know when a small bottle will come in handy. This game's pretty good. This game's pretty fun to stream. It's interesting. Alexander sorts it's like more interesting. There's nothing. Then you get dead-ended at that part. That part sucks. So we got an ink bottle. He dumped this out. Alexander's carrying a little ink bottle. It appears to be empty. Yeah, what if I dip this feather in that? There's no reason to use that on the ink box. Actually, it is because you can draw with it. Good day, anyway, Prince Alexander. Anyway, Alex release date. October 17th. We've got until October 17th to finish Gothic. Gothic 1. And then we can't play Alex until we finish Gothic 1. Hey, Travis. It looks great. Yeah, and it's, it's pretty cool. I think we need the Tinder. Would you mind trade it in? Of course. Get the Tinder Alex thing. I believe. Very I think this Thank is you. correct. Um, if not, then piggly pig, piggly pig shit. We're screwed. Now, hopefully, I might have to. Bry guy, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you for the hundred bits, Bry guy. Thank you very much. I enjoyed those bits, thank you. There's a bird in the tree now? No! There's a bird in the tree now? I didn't see it. I was too busy thinking about wrestling. Oh, I hear it. Hello? Is anyone in there? Hello? There is no reply. Is the bird? Oh, there's a bird over there. Hello, Nightingale. What a lovely I didn't see it. Sing. The Nightingale only looks at Alexander suspiciously and continues to sing. We have to go back. Oh, wait. No, we don't have to go back. 
The nightingale is here. We have to go give it the fake nightingale. We also have to get that lamp from over the boiling water. This is the only cake you gave me to play Dracoon House? Alright, we'll, we'll do this for- wait, but what happens- no, we, we'll, we'll be able to keep the Nightingale. Would you mind We're just gonna I... taunt the Nightingale course... and make him think he's we... got a mountain and probably get an egg. That must... We're just gonna steal the Nightingale's eggs. Very good. Thank you. By tricking it, making it think this is a ma mate. It appears to be empty like his invisible ink. Could be. Could be. Do you think there's a genie? What happened to Lamp Guy? Am I dead ended? Because Lamp Guy's gone. Alright, trick this nightingale by putting this in here. Make a save. Night. Alexander. Give this. Puzzwiz. Alexander winds the mechanical nightingale and places it on the ground. Yeah, do it. What's? Why would you do this? You're just tricking this bird. For what reason? For your own entertainment? Abusing nature? For your own the entertainment? The mechanical nightingale sings a sweet, tinny tune. The real nightingale in the tree cocks her head and listens intently. The nightingale flies to a lower branch and looks at Alexander curiously, as if she were deciding that this human might not be so bad. Oh, it's getting the nightingale to like me. Now I can touch it. Although the nightingale seems interested in Alexander, she would never allow him close enough to grab her. Maybe we can talk to it. You're financing Elix, Ethiopian National Bank. That's great. Hello, little nightingale. Of what do you sing? The nightingale only looks at Alexander curiously and continues to sing. Do I play the flute with it now or something? I don't know what that did. Where are you going? Oh. The nightingale sings her crystalline song in the boughs of the old tree. The Talk nightingale looks at Alexander curiously, as though waiting for something. How easy is it to dead end the cat and rat part in the previous King's Quest game? Very easy. Hello, little nightingale. You have the like three seconds to figure out what to do. Although the nightingale... Luckily, I remembered that part. It came back to me from my subconscious. Uh, you want this again? Do you, you just want this again? Alexander winds Do this the mechanical again. nightingale. We tweedle. I've got this bird still. It plays its I've got a fake... This is tune. fake bird for you. The living nightingale in the tree listens to the tune curiously. Give it a feather. Hey, another bird died. You want it? Alexander shows the object. Oh, to the bird, I've got to give it an object. Interest her. The little bird. We've got to give it something. I don't know what. You want a rabbit's foot? Alexander. The so you bring it closer with the nightingale, and then you got to give it. You got to give it something, but I don't know what. Maybe we get it later. And give it an egg. Maybe you give it an egg and then it hatches the egg for you. Something like that. Give the bird back. Would you mind? I don't think we're supposed to give it the flute or the paintbrush. The only thing I, I can believe... think is get the tinderbox and Thank go you. to the top of the mountain and see what's in that cave. Yeah, it's it's pretty ridiculous, Flaos. It's that's pretty rough. Even when I knew what to do. It, it, it happens really quick. I guess it depends on the speed that you have on. I had the max speed on. So you probably have a lot more time if you don't have max speed on. Paintbrush? I don't think so, Geister. I don't think so. I personally don't think so. Alexander. But I could always be wrong. She eats the mint. Uh, Sacred Alexander. Mountain. That's a big mountain. And there's not a lot here. There's only like three areas. Hi, Omar. Bye, Omar. Omar's leaving and watching a movie. Um, I, I Omar's the only one that's actually allowed to leave and watch a movie. If anyone else leaves right now, I'm taking a snapshot of... I'm taking a snapshot of the viewers list. Climbing again. And if I notice that anyone left to watch a movie in about, let's say, a few minutes, you're permanently banned. And you're also permanently banned if you have a perm. Bye, Omar. Thanks for watching. You're the only one allowed to leave right now. No one else get any ideas from Iomore. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. Let's go see if we can Alexander find anything in this little cave over here. Do 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 do. Oh, I want to make an announcement. 
And spread this to all your friends. Hey, Conger. Alexander yeah, you, not forever. Just till the end of the stream, Conger. I am more. You can close the stream. It's okay. You're allowed. I have an announcement to make. There's no stream tomorrow morning. I have to go drive far away to another area, another work area, a second work building, and deal with Windows 98 and Windows 2000 machines and be in hell. So there's no stream tomorrow morning. If I get out of work at like 1, maybe by noon, 1, 2 p.m., maybe I can do a stream in the evening. Um, but I have a work thing tomorrow. There will still be a stream Wednesday night for sure. I think I'm there again Wednesday. Maybe I can start the stream earlier on Wednesday. Do I get a, you get a refund? No, no, you don't get any money back. And you actually have to give more money, believe it or not. It's weird, but Windows 98 is awful, Morgan Le Fay. I hate Windows 98. I guess I just hate it in the context of what I need to use it for for work. Because it's ridiculous to use it. It'd be fun if I was just using it to play games, but I'm not. I'm trying to make it work for, like, this old cash register system. It's dumb. Uh, Windows 2000 is great, because it can actually connect to WPA2. Windows 98 cannot. You have to use WEP, and anyone can just hack into your shit. It's awful, but anyway. Sorry, no stream tomorrow morning. I'll, I'll, you can follow my Discord or Twitter. I'll give you updates on if I can stream tomorrow evening. Or if I can stream earlier on Wednesday to make up for it. Because I'm such a horrible person with a horrible exactly. job. That is making me do a horrible thing and not stream. Alexander takes the candle from his tinder box and uses the flint in the They box have unofficial service it. pack three. Yeah, I'd have to figure out how to get it on the machine because you can't like plug a USB into Windows 98 and the floppy disk, the floppy disk drive like wasn't working. I don't know. That's good to know, hamsters. Go. I'll think about that. I'd rather just like pretend that the Windows 98 machines don't work and throw them in the trash. Okay, let's save as cave. Cave. Windows 2000 is good. Windows 98 bad. If they're all Windows 98 machines down there, I don't care. I'm gonna look like an idiot, and I don't care if I look like an idiot that doesn't know what he's doing. I don't feel like screwing with him. Alexander crawls. Next the one. In the rock. 2000s. Okay, Jeremy. For for my work purposes. Yeah, it is a it's a literal POS the system. In this part of the cave is better. Alexander extinguishes would hack the into a cash register and places it back in his Who pack. would hack into a financial system? I don't even know if hack... You, they use a really, really old... I'm giving people bad ideas. They There's use like no a going. really, really... They, everything they use is old and they need to update it. You can make a cash register out of... Like, so many things nowadays. I don't know why they're doing it like this. And that's your work rant of the Alexander day. takes a few leaves from the plant. As he does so, a strong smell They've got of old printers... Peppermint. Ah. Oh, that's a plant. I didn't even know that was a plant. Alexander. I thought I was clicking on this. So now we got more mints. We got mint peppermint leaves. They're using old printers with like printer ribbons. And mouse balls. It's horrible, guys. The window in the rock is too small for Alexander to fit through. Oh, is the whole point just to get the mint in here? There's no... There's no... There's no... A natural window-like yeah, opening. Yeah, you can in the rock use, you can turn your phone into a cash world. register. A peppermint plant grows. And they're on using the Windows 98 machines. I don't care. I'll do what they want. You want to pay me to screw around with that stuff? I don't care. It's dumb though. The window. Maybe is the whole point just to get the mint Alex here? Alex, 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 Alex. Okay, I'm gonna go back. Alexander crawls back into the first room of the cave. Do, 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 do. They Alexander thought I was into it because they hired me as Retrograde Tom Tom. That's true. Alexander can't see a thing. The Alexander isopropyl alcohol. Yeah, mouse balls. Day. Yes, mouse balls. I showed a picture on my Twitter of the mouse balls. Oh, I just got a text message. What if my boss is a viewer? He's not. Uh, Got a text. My boss. Okay. Oh, the other thing that sucks, I have to drive my boss there. I, w I was trying to drive by myself, but I, I couldn't get out of not driving with my boss. My boss is okay, but I'd rather be by myself, you know. Uh, all right. There's no re There's no reason to touch that. We got the peppermint leaves. Uh, what do we use those for? You think the bird wants those? Oops. No! You fucking piece of shit! Why do you have a scarf? I just noticed Alexander's scarf. 
plop. Crappy doodles. Alexander. How long's the drive? Uh, like an hour. Around an hour, maybe a little less. It's okay, I just would rather go by myself. The lighting in I wanna go by myself. The I might get free lunch, though. Free lunch might be worth it. I had to download Alexander. some other podcasts. Other than the ones I normally listen Alexander. to. The video- I can't listen to video game podcasts with my boss in the car, probably. Alexander. It's not even from the Millennium Alexander. Spurious, I know. <laughs> Keep it off of Red to <laughs> Just turn that on like he gets in the car. Ready to go? Ready to go, boss? Yeah. Put on some shades. Flick on the music. Let's go. I'm too sexy for my body. The way I'm disco dancing. <laughs> Let's go. This is the labyrinth. Go! How do you get down? Step on that. How do you get down from here? He won't go. Go down. Oops. What? Have you ever farted and thrown it at someone? Hmm. Is it? Yeah, it might be an ascot. It looks like a scarf to me. I don't Alex know how to go down. There's no. There's no. I don't know how to go down, guys. Comedy bang bang. You could do that too. I'm just gonna listen to. I don't know. I don't even know what. I can't go down anymore. It won't let me. There. I had to click on the right. There we go. Uh, the model, Cole. you know what I mean. I can just sing it. What if I just sang right, said Fred? <laughs> the radio's broken, boss. I hope you don't mind, but I'm just gonna sing some songs. You know, it helps me keep entertained as I drive. I am a model, you know what I mean, as I do my little turn on the catwalk. Anything you want to hear? I'm taking requests, boss. Alexander climbs carefully down the long face of the logic cliffs. I like how he turns around and then steps down backwards like a child would. Like a child descending stairs. Alright, we've got a lot of stuff now. I don't think we need this tinder Alexa anymore. We should go get the flute or the paintbrush. I think we should go get the flute. Alexander. Which podcast do I listen to? Mostly just the Giant Bomb podcast. And I never run out because I don't listen to it enough to catch up. But now that I listen at work, I've been listening at work a little bit. Uh, probably listen to Comedy Bang Bang because I like Comedy Bang Bang. I like Giant Bomb. I like other comedy podcasts like, uh, I forget the guy's name. I forget the guy's name, but I like this one comedian. A very dry sense of humor. It is, his name is Todd Barry Podcast. Todd Barry's pretty good. You should watch the Todd Barry uh, crowd work tour where he just does crowd work. And he doesn't do actual like jokes and stuff. It's pretty. It's pretty good. You, I think you can watch it on Netflix, or it's like two dollars on Louis C.K.'s website, or five dollars or something. Look it up. Would you mind if I traded this? I think in? it's on Netflix. Of course, Prince. Todd Barry Crowdwork Tour. I think I'll know when I can use this. Let's take the flute. I'll take the. I'll take the flute. The flute. The flute. Thank you. You want my flute? Yes, I want your flute. Alt right radio. <laughs> Put on some alt right radio. All right. Put on like the most uh, horrific thing I can I can think of. New save. Flute. Flute team. Okay. So let's think. We've got some words. We've got some ink. We've got a feather. We've got some. I mean, what if I'm supposed to paint with this? We've got a boring book. We've got a stinky flower. We've got a mint. We've got a a, a, a peppermint. The peppermint leaf. Why would you have peppermint and mint? Alexander fingers a handful of peppermint leaves. Ew, Alexander, knock it off. Of mint. Yeah, the giant bomb cast. Sing to him in macho, mi macho mint voice. Stop fingering the... Alexander fingers a handful stop of... Stop it, Alexander, stop! Alexander he can't stop fingering this handful of, of peppermint leaves. What a disgusting freak. Stop fingering the peppermint leaves, Alexander. God, this, you gross me out. You think the bird wants any of this stuff? Hey, bird, you want these peppermints? I want peppermint Alexander, leaves. Nope, he doesn't like pet. She doesn't like pet mate. You want a flower? Alexander shows the object to the bird. The nightingale doesn't like the smell of that flower at all. That's not it. Uh, the ink is not paint. Tro, tro. You want a mint? Alexander. You like drunk mints? The peppermint, 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 peppermint. You want a boring book? The little bird couldn't do anything with something that. I gotta heavy. give it something. 
We gotta give it something. Crowd work just left Netflix. Oh, it sucks. Yeah, it's five bucks. You should buy it. If you like comedy, go buy it. It's a. Uh, it's real good. It's real good. If you like comedy, go get it. Alexander. Don't be a cheap ass. Go get it right now. That's what I listen to, pretty much. I used to listen to the Joe Rogan podcast because I also used to like MMA, but Joe Rogan got a little weird. All right, we should go Isle of the Beast is two-thirds. Peppermint's going to help him. Alexander Fuel. Oops, wrong one. Oh, that's screw up. I didn't want to go there. I need to go to the Isle of Wonder, right? Not back here. I don't think we have anything that can get across the boiling water unless we throw the mint in. We could try throwing the mint in there. I mean, it's cool. Let's just save here, Flutie. Save over this, Flutie. Throw that, uh, throw this mint in. Mint. That would have no effect on the boiling water. Whoever bond. said that, you're wrong. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea, Rhombus. I like that idea. Maybe that would work. That would have. Maybe I get a raise. Joe Rogan. I, I know. I don't know. I don't know. He got. He just got a little. He's still. I still like him, Alexander. but I just stopped listening to him for a bit. I've seen him live a couple times, Joe Rogan, and he's good. Alexander. He's a good comedian. But uh, some of these guys have a tendency to be a little too. They go a little too much into the like. Uh, how, what's the w good way to put it? Like just being shocking as uh, as the hook instead of actually being clever. I think you fell into it a little bit. I think he's still good though. Peppermint in your mouth. Those oysters are all sleeping peacefully. No, no, no. This one. That won't do anything for the little oyster. Oh, what about this mint? This will numb your mouth. That won't do anything for the little really? oyster. Really? UFC 214. You know, I've fallen out of paying attention to UFC also. I used to do MMA and stuff and jujitsu and watch watch UFC, but I fell out of it. Who's in it? Anybody good, J-Dub? Floaty. Cheering and clapping is good. Uh, yeah, right. Yeah, he's into the crazy conspiracy stuff. He's a little bit too much into that stuff, and I'm definitely not. Let's see. We could try to go up against these dwarves. Want to give this a shot? Want to give this a shot? Alexander. You're right. You need an anti-numbing pain. Okay, so the first thing is the nose. And it's a flower. You think we have... I don't think we have the item, so maybe. Alexander holds Stinky the flower. flower stench out to the gnome with the jumbo nose. Gonna stink real bad. Tom Troll I am. That's all I'll be. My nose knows all on land and sea. A Ew. flower of stench has washed ashore. A flower tis all and nothing more. These portraits are so well done. That's good ass pixel art. Ear guy. Listen, Flute. Oh no. What if we need the nightingale here? Do you think we need the nightingale or ears? Uh, ears, ears, ears. I guess all I really have is the flute, unless I bring the nightingale here. Alexander. Is that gonna work? Omar, you're back. You were allowed to leave, it's okay. A flute, it's true, is a harmless thing. But the man who blows it, there's the sting. Ah, uh, he knew it was a man blowing it. A man, a man. Aw, oh, man. He knew it was a man blowing it. Damn. Okay. I don't think we have anything else that makes noise. We could try the nightingale. Maybe he won't know that it's a fake nightingale. And then what do we do for the guy with eyes who can see us? I don't think we have the thing we need. I showed a rabbit foot. I don't think we have the things we need for this. Alexander, P don't know what to do for this thing tooth. Welcome back, Iomore. Uh, Daniel Cormier versus John Jones. Oh, John Jones is back. The guy who got in trouble with cocaine is, and maybe he's back on the track now. Alexander, that'd be cool. Oh, the boring. The movie was boring. Hmm. 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 Feeling stuck again. Feeling a little stuck. Let's get that speed all the way up. Some, give something to the bird. I like the music when you're looking at the bird. Sounds kind of like that berserk music. There could be someone else back here. Maybe I go do something with that girl. But... Yeah, I'm gonna get the nightingale again. Would you mind? This doesn't make... I just feel like this isn't gonna work, though. That So we've got someone with hands. Very good, the hands Prince would Alex. feel like it a rabbit foot. A Thank you. The flower for the smell. 
The, the hands could be the rabbit foot. What is else? There's eyes, ears, smell. Eyes, I don't know what eyes are. Ears, nightingale, smell, flower, touch, rabbit foot, mouth. Gotta taste something. He could taste the mint or the peppermint and it's just think it's a plant. I don't know what the looking would be. Maybe invisible ink on yourself? Let's save over Fluty. We know which one it is. Invisible ink? There's no reason to use that there. Use it on yourself. Alexander decides to open the Ooh. empty ink bottle. Ooh. Ooh. It's stuck. It's... It's... Plurp. Whoa! Whoa! Invisible ink. The ink bottle isn't empty at all. <laughs> it's full of invisible ink. Subconscious power! Hey, Beard. Not bad. That bear is flexing hard. Subconscious power knew it was invisible ink. Alexander doesn't want to- Yes! I think we might have all the items we need. Let's do it. Great success! That was the power of the subconscious. Also, I think Flail said something about invisible ink or something. Somebody said something. Alexander- I'm- uh, if I'm not- If I'm one thing, it's honest. Alexander- I'm honest about the puzz power. So they, 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 they've made that bear flex like that beard. It's wrong, right? Taxidermy's wrong. Flutie. Let's go. We can do this, I think. Alexander. If the nightingale works. If the nightingale doesn't work, we done. We can't do it. I don't have a noise thing. I need like, uh, I need to catch the nightingale and bring it. We need to bring the nightingale, the actual nightingale, with us. Alexander. Alright, one down. Ears, if this doesn't work, Listen. we're done. Listen up. Got a noise for you. Alexander winds go, go, the go, tin come nightingale on. and places He's gonna the know it's fake. The monumental He's gonna know ears. it's fake. Is he gonna know it's fake? Don't don't let him hear the winding, no! He can hear that! Stop winding, it's Oh, he likes it. <laughs> oh, this game's funny. Go right without triggering him? Oh, but I want to trick him, Rhombus. A nose is not a way to spy. My ears he didn't know. cannot be told yeah, a lie. Yeah, we can do the it. Nightingale is all there be. No man is near, and so say me. We can do this now. He didn't realize that with the whining, he just thought it was farts. Taste the rump rump that we might know, whether the friend or whether foe. Um... Mint? Or that... Oh, let's make a save. Let's make a save. Gnomes. Gnomes taste. It could be this peppermint leaf. Alexander holds the item out He's for the gnome taste. with the oversized mouth. It's mint. My tongue dislikes this sour thing, and the taste of man all over it clings. Damn. A man. He knew it was a man. Okay, maybe the other mint. The taste is going to be on this too. Alexander holds the mint out for the gnome with the gigantic mouth. We have to put mint on the mint. Grump Flump knows a tasty treat. It matters not what others bleat. Oh. No danger is this one so sweet. Nice. That mint did it. Trilly Dilly, use your hands. Is it beast or is it man? The rabbit's foot has to work, right? No, I'm taste. It's gotta be the rabbit's foot. Come on. Alexander holds the rabbit foot out for the gnome with the huge hands. Huge hands. What if he touches my hand, too? He can't see. Be all you mad? What aileth thee? A bunny can't trill merrily. <laughs> a hare does not at all taste sweet. A rabbit here is all we greet. Huge hands. Now it's time. Old Bill we can do this. Never fatter. Vision can resolve this matter. He's fatter. Look you now and end this chatter. Old Bill Batter, never fatter. Let's save again. He's not that fat. Oh my god, that's so cruel. Invisible ink. Alexander pours the Puzzle. contents of the empty looking ink bottle over himself. Hope I didn't have to use these anywhere else. Nothing there. 
Get out of here. By all that's beauteous, fair, and sightly, four morons do I sleep with nightly. There's nothing there at all, I say. <laughs> Enough of this. Let's now away. You sleep with four morons? They all hate each other. Um, the, seriously, the lip sync is out of control. That's actually a huge accomplishment, I feel like. The lip sync in this Alexander game. did it. He's fooled the guards. Yeah. Let's go to the island. Be good. Gnome taste. That's, uh, cool. Nice job, me. Good job, me. You're incredible. You got past all the gnomes and you figured it out. Without any hints. Wow. This streamer is something else. We got a little tissue over here. Mm, wow. Hiya, gorgeous. Oh, what a luscious looking hunk of flesh you are. Uh, thank you. I guess. Who are you? <gasps> How charming of you to pretend not to know. I'm Black Widow, of course. The femme fatale of all femme fatales. Know what I mean? <laughs> you Why know, does she not have a portrait? I was just thinking it was time I found my 50th, uh, another husband. It would be quite Gary. a horror. Uh, I mean, an honor to have me as a bride. <laughs> just look at my beautiful weaving. Yeah, you're a spider it's and I'm a human. Right. So delicate. It would wear him out. You'll never want it would to wear him out, beard, sleeping with four nest. morons every night. Hmm. It is a lovely web. But my heart is elsewhere, I'm afraid. Don't I love the gradient uh, on Alexander's I mean, face, too. The loss is Crazy. Yours. I'm sure you'll change your mind once you consider the advantages. So we gotta marry this widow? What is this? That scrap of paper blew into my web from those books over there. Mm, the wind just thinks it can deposit anything here. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Badass guitar solo. What's up with these books in your web, though? An intricately detailed spider's web has been spun between a pile of books and a small tree. Okay. If I take this, I'm dead, correct? I can't save. Uh, I'm going to leave. Because if I take that, I'm dead. I'm going to leave and save. Gnome's taste. Alexander. Whoops! That's right. Go with your feelings. Yeah, the Get porn music. Get closer to me. Alexander feels the tiny pinprick of the spider's bite and the slow burning of her poison. <laughs> it plays the porn music when you die. Not really porn music, whatever that music is. There's bees up here. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the memory. Maybe I gotta get the bees caught in the web. But you think the husband is, uh, I'm a husband when you kill me? Hmm. Hmm. Peppermint. Alexander wouldn't want. Alexander offers the item to the Black Widow. You want mint? No, you like mint? No, thank you, you sweet man. Like a good little wife, I have no interest in anything except my cozy little web. And you. I can't take this, I'm dead. Alexander reaches out to grab the scrap of parchment. After dead. my. Alexander. Dead. Okay. Mm Don't know what to get caught in that. We've got the paintbrush. We've got the flute. Let's look at these bees. Can I talk Alexander to them? Alexander can't. Alexander. They're buzz. Buzz. Oh. Alexander. Buzz. Buzz. Just says buzz. Books. Alexander sees. Search the books. What's that? Oh, a caterpillar. All right. Cool. Hey. Hands off the goods there, son. These are your books. Oh, sorry. Do I have a newspaper? No. Oh, I do have this crappy book. You want this? There's no reason to use... You want this? Alexander wouldn't want... We do have a book. Hello? Is anyone there but in the book? Look books? at this gradient. No, there's no one here. Doesn't work like that. I know you're in there. I've got a book for you. There's no reason... Let's talk to him some more. Get out here. Hello? Is anyone there all in the, the books? About. It's all the buzz about. No, there's no one here. All right. He doesn't want to talk or take my book. And if we search, he makes me stop. Caterpillar. <laughs> Hands oh. off the goods. Does that happen no matter where I do it? 
Yes, it does. <laughs> oh. I can't give him anything. If I reach up there, he comes out. He always says hands oh. off the goods. Do I have to play a flute for him? Uh, I lost the invisible ink. That sucks. What if I give him this? There's no reason. There's no, There's no reason there to no use that on a pile of books. I'll give you a book for another book. There's well, no reason to use that. Yeah, he's a bookworm. Yeah, There's yeah, no yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, not a caterpillar, a There's bookworm. No He's a bookworm. There's no re It's been a while since I've seen a bookworm. There's no re All right, so there's a bookworm here and there's a spider. Let's go the other way. Book here and spider. I like how I don't really have to map. Um, this is the first King's Quest where you don't really have to make a map. There's lots logical, smaller, separated areas, and there's a branch over there. No, I'm staced. There's a face over here. The fallen log has a good-sized knot or bump. There's a face here. A large tree stretches knotted limbs out over the swamp. No vacuum cleaner. Part of the tree's trunk is shaped like the face of a dog. Why, it must be a dogwood tree. Yes, because it's the Isle of Wonder and everything's crazy here. A stick is stuck in the middle of the swamp. Stick in the mud. <laughs> Milkweed thrives near the mucky swamp. Oh. Small bottles filled with milk grow on it like fruit. We need milk. We need that milk. Get that milk. Alexander Got that takes milk. a bottle of milk from the milkweed bush. Oh, you didn't realize you could go right there? A dog is mad. Apparently, the dogwood tree doesn't like Alexander standing that close. What's he going to do about it? He, he, all he can do is bark. Let's talk to this knot. That bump on the log does not look particularly conversational to Alexander. Oh, we're going to have to map something later? I'm fine mapping a maze. We own that maze in King's Quest V. The bump on the log does not look particularly interesting. Okay, let's talk to the stick. Hello, stick. Alexander sees no point in trying to talk to that stick in the swamp. Hmm. Is that so? Numb taste. Let's walk in. Let's walk over to it. Definitely the not going to die. Dog sinks beneath Alexander's Definitely weight. fine. He feels himself being sucked. This slowly, isn't day of the tentacle. Hold your fire. Definitely not going to die. Going into the swamp. We're going to be fine. We're not dead, we just went to Swampland. Water fills Alexander's mouth. He thinks that although he'd always wanted to try a mud bath, this is hardly what he had in mind. The maze is mapped in the manual. Let me go see. Is it this? Decades of next. Is that the map? Get that sinking feeling. No, it goes right to King's Quest 7. That's King's Quest 7, guys. It's got a different art style. Over 2.5 million sold. They put that right on the top, so you would know you should buy King's Quest. Is this the map? That looks like it could be a map. That's cheap. They shouldn't give you a map. You should you should have to map it out. What is it, King's Quest becoming casual? King's Quest is a casual game. I mapped in King's. I mapped in every King's Quest though. Pizzicato, I did. I'm a mapper. I mapped King's Quest Five Maze the all by myself. The is full of milk. I'm a hardcore gamer, guys. Okay, I don't know what to do here. Oh, this. I remember this part. I mean, I remember this scene. Maybe this is where you um paint a hole in the... You paint something somewhere. This is weird. Talk to these vegetables. Hello. Aren't you a bunch of fine-looking It was plants? subtle in the original. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Apparently, the baby's, baby's tears. tears haven't learned to talk yet. <laughs> baby's tears. Tomatoes. Good day, tomato vines. Good morning. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, lettuce. The lettuce just gives Alexander the cold shoulder. Alexander addresses the We're grapes. turning in this, this into Kyrandia 3. Why are you so sour, if you don't mind my asking? Well, we'll tell you. How would you like to have the possibility of being made into wine hanging over your head? And then, there's our neighbors, the clinging vines. All they do all day is whine about the Ivy League social climbers that never call. It's really just not fun at all. Hmm, Understood. that's too bad. Well, I hope things start looking up. Thanks a lot. Let's talk to these flowers. Greetings, ladies. How charming you look today. It's a gateway drug. Mapping's the a gateway drug. are too shy to talk to Alexander. Now what's this thing over here? This guy. Let's 
Yeah, we're fine doing this save still. What's this what guy? What a curious little black spot. The hole in the wall does not reply. Yeah, hole in the wall. Can I take it? Alexander decides to pick up the hole in the wall. A hole in the wall could be a very useful thing. It's a hole in the wall. And we can take it. Or not. Yes? No. Alexander startled the poor thing. It's run off to hide behind the wallflowers. Let's see if we can get it. Maybe we just have to move it. They're guarding it. Oh! And they're snapping at the me. The wallflowers, overcome with shyness at Alexander's approach, cluster together and cover the hole in the wall. Alexander can't get it. We gotta, um, overcome their shy. We gotta figure out how to make them not shy. Good day, snapdragons. They're snapping away. The snapdragons don't seem inclined to communicate with anyone. What's up with this table? Let's look at it first. To the right of the path is a little coffee table. A little coffee table, huh? We gotta have a little party. You want some milk? Would you lovely flowers be interested in this? It's very la- No, they're snapping. Guess not. Lettuce, cold shoulder. Look at these flowers. The wallflowers look terribly shy. Mmm, touch. Alexander is too far away from home to think about taking furniture back with him. This looks like a grumpy tomato. Alexander takes a close look ah, at the tomato is. on the ground. It appears to be darker than those on the vines. It's what different. are you staring at there, boy? Rotten tomato. Throw away, you rootless thing, you! Yeah. 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 That tomato is It's a rotten, rotten tomato. Let's talk to it. How did you manage to fall off the vine, Mr. Tomato? What do you think? I'm old, I'm rotten. Yeah, leave me alone. Yeah. If you say so. After when you're all, old, you, you say yeah a lot. You're just rot on this dry ground like everybody else, aren't you? I'll pick you up. Why, I don't know. I, I suppose... Ah, never mind. Just go away. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Let's pick him up. I'll pick you up. Hey, what do you I'm think you're doing you. here? I'm helping you. Get your yeah. hands off me. Hey. No, I'm help picking you up and putting you on the table. Alexander picks up Rotten Tomato oh, I'm taking and him. puts him away. I'm kidnapping him. One never him. knows when one will need a Rotten Tomato. Oh, I thought I was helping him. I was actually just putting him inside of my bag. The old Rotten Tomato gives <laughs> up. Okay, that works too. The guy from Everybody Loves Raymond. And I've never really seen that show. Well, don't snap me to death. Those snap. I want to save here. We'll keep snakes. We'll saving here. Hopefully, we're not dead ended. That's it's a bad idea to keep saving over this old one. I can't go this way. Sounds those walls because of the snappers. Uh, what if I give you a feather? Would you ladies be at all interested in this? Ask it for the wallflowers. Yeah, angry. Decline. That's you on the subway. Nah, get away. That's because if you touch anybody on the subway, you'll get hepatitis. What would they be interested in if they're shy? A flute? A paintbrush? A tinderbox? A words? A book? Would you lay the No, I don't think they're interested in any of this. You want peppermints? Would you lay the I think this is a random solution. I think I guess you have to try everything I have. Would you the Because it might be one of these random items. I still have this would flower you too. The what? This is a flower. The tomato. Would you love the snapdragons, I can get past them, too. Guess what not. would they want? The to Babies? Would you ba- The baby's tears only look- They don't want it. Let's go check this door. I think you gotta get this hole over here. Oh, no. I can just go through the gate. I was incorrect. Here's the thing, though, guys. Gnome's taste. We're not dead-ended, I hope. Here's the thing, guys. I gotta get up early and do a work thing tomorrow. That kind of sucks. So I've gotta go. Thanks for hanging out watching the stream tonight. I stream in the evenings on Mondays and Wednesdays now, 6 p.m. Eastern. Tomorrow, I normally stream in the mornings at 9 a.m. Eastern on Tuesdays and Thursdays. However, I've got to do a work thing tomorrow. Taking off your adventurer's cap so soon? Yes, I've had it. So I won't be streaming tomorrow morning. Maybe there will be an evening or afternoon stream tomorrow. Maybe not. But there will definitely be an evening stream Wednesday, and there will definitely be a morning stream Thursday as of right now. But no stream in the morning tomorrow. I'm sorry. You can't get your money back, however. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Who do you guys want to host? Uh, let's see who we could host today. Thank you for hanging out. Um, and watching the game. Hope you enjoyed the game. We could host Bagel. 
playing the rest of Menzo Baronzan. Bagel's playing the Bagel's playing Menzo Baronzan. Classic Bagel streaming a dungeon crawler. We'll host Bagel. How about that? Go watch Bagel. Twitch.tv slash Bagel 411. Go watch him. And I've got to go. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to follow the channel. And don't forget, uh,